Earth. My window's dialed in here. I'm hoping it's not too loud when I come in. I got it adjusted way down, but if I have to, I can always just slide the volume, the stream volume down if it's making people's ears bleed. I would say mm. the music and the effects. Oh, I've got everything going. down right now. I've got the master at, at 30% or so, and then everything else below 50. You won't, you won't be able to hear her talking when she starts, when the dialogue. All right, well, here goes. Like, I, turned mine, I turned mine all the way down, like, quite far as well when I first started it, but... Ah, it I says got, lurking in main menu for Omni. Uh, Oh, there we go. Uh, well, the it's the intro minders. Once it hits, it's it's loud, loud. I thought I just hit join. Oh, there we go. Accept invites. Join friend. Joining online session. I am joining the online session. I was gonna say, yeah, maybe I should have waited a second. Uh, you're a few hours late there. I mean, I played DD2 all morning over on Twitch. Every Friday on Twitch, but I'm not playing any more DD2 today. I certainly am not going to go shard farming in KS1, sorry dude, but I'm just not going to do it. <laughs> Alright, it skipped it, it put me right on the ground. It's actually, I'm kind of froze up here. Maybe I'm just, oh, there we go. Oh, see now it's really low, that's weird. How far away are we? Mm, I'm not sure. I gotta adjust these volumes though. They they gotta dial that in for sure. The Frick shift. See, dialogue needs to go way up. Do you know? Is it the same map every time, or is it random? Yes, it's the same. Oh, okay. Well, you'll be able to learn the map then anyway. You know. What's going on there, Yankee Islander? How you doing? <laughs> Not gonna laugh my ass off if that's Omni that's pink on the on it the is. HUD. What? <laughs> yep. uh, what? Is there I'm anything leaving, I should I'm, be collecting I'm on the way over? I'm, I'm abandoning you guys. <laughs> Just grab leaves and stuff on the way over. You did that intentionally, I know that. Uh think Factorio but in 3D. There, uh, Javier. If you minor healing properties, further analysis required to establish object scanner identification. Uh, that guy's a bit close. This consumable possesses minor healing properties. Further analysis. I'm coming over, I'm going towards you guys, but I can't tell how far away you are. Well, I am this up on a ridge here. Is there anything else I need to be snagging on the whoa? That thing no, is I just big. Keep yeah, just keep grabbing on your way. Is that like a space cow? <laughs> yeah. Is, is it friendly? Are all the enemies... I mean, the monsters that are there, are they... Uh, are they gonna attack? That thing is crazy yeah, looking. Yeah, I'm gonna go look at it. Is this thing gonna stop me? This big space cow? I'm gonna equip your zapper. Oop, oop, oop. Let's see. How do you do that? There we go. Yeah. I found it. <laughs> oh, I am ready to zap some mofos now. Initial scans reveal coloring properties in the flower petals. Further analysis required. Further analysis required. Indeed, Omni is pretty in pink, no doubt. <laughs> Well, it's the perfect day for it, so I'll let it slide for today. Is there fall damage? Yes. Yes. Alright. Yes. That's not too bad, though. I'm gonna go towards you, I think, Joe. I still don't... I wish there was some kind of a range where I could tell how far away you guys are. Oh, I see. I see ya, I see ya. I see a structure being created over there. Congratulations. You have unlocked Be in bed, it's like early for me. It's what, four in the afternoon for me, Jonas? Look out behind you! <laughs> oh, dang! Oh, is this like... 
<laughs> that thing is just running in circles. Die, Betty. Get wrecked. Mm. Right, okay, so this thing is tracking progress for all of us then. Oh, perfect. That's what we need. All right, is there a motion blur? Because that motion blur was irritating. Let's see. Texture shadow. I don't see motion blur. That's unfortunate. The motion blur with combat was a little bit on the irritating side. I think it was just the mob in general. Yeah, it was that, like the run animation. Oh, okay. Anyway, y'all, this is a beta. It's going to be buggy, and not only is it going to be buggy, but they said that it's really buggy in co-op, but we figured what the hell. We'll give it a shot anyway. And, uh... Joe and Omni have been playing a little bit, but this is my very first time in. You want to walk me through what you're doing there, Joe? Yeah, so I gathered a bunch of iron, I smelt it into ingots, and then over on the hub here, you've got a objective to upgrade. So I'm oh, I got to see. Upgrade the Ooh. Congratulations. You have unlocked hub feature biomass generator. Hub feature personal storage. Speed um, you could push power. X, uh, which will give you all the information Building of like the little tutorial stuff. Oh, okay, nice. When built, build menu What's going on, Leon? Is there anything you need me to be grabbing, or what should I be doing right now? Objective. Hub upgrade construction. Note. Connect um, to a generator. I see an army over there. Note. Building such we'll need to gather. Oh, guys actually. Oh, yeah. Okay, you guys are. Advice, need to gather what if you if you push c it'll ping on where ores and stuff are for you um, oh, okay just now you're just now you're kind of limited to what it is that you can do if you hold c then you can kind of pick which one you actually want to search for gotcha but you're limited to what it is that you can actually do, do we want copper now. or iron or both both both. Um. All right. Well, I don't even know what the nodes look like. See, it says it's ten meter. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's, yeah. Press E. Tell you. Press and hold E tell to you. pick up iron it ore. I right, gotcha. Yeah. It tells you the like how good the nor well the the node is as well. Like on the far right, you'll see it says normal. So it kind of tells you how oh, yeah, much yeah. is there. Yeah. How much is it? I mean, do they have a lot? I'm not too sure on what each one is at the moment. Like I've only seen normal so far. So. Like we make. I'm going to grab copper. How do you open your inventory? Tab. Tab. Alright. So I got 60 iron ore, a bunch of nuts, some wood, a bunch of leaves, and flower petals. Oh my god, these guys. I'll just keep hammering away on this ore for a minute. If you push Q, it brings up your crafting menu, kind of. Oh, I gotcha. Q thing as well. Smelter. So what, we're trying to work, what are we working what on we're now? What we're looking to do is the equipment workshop. Gotcha. Right now is what it is that we're trying to get. Fine. The hub. That's the first thing you put down, assuming. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's your base of operations. Gotcha. Are you streaming on me? I, yes. This says Omni needs to stream with SR on it. It'd be a pink best of marathon. <laughs> you get out of here right now. You get in, you come in here. I'm banning you instantly. <laughs> Celebrating Women's Day. Oh, I see the shortcuts at the bottom. Now, obviously, I don't know what any of those do yet, other than C and Q. But can you change on those hotkeys right. if you want? I don't know. I haven't tried. No, it seems, it seems find a reason to really. F is dismantle. Yeah. B is your flashlight. 
C is scan, X is mail, and tab is inventory. Do I have any mail? Oh, okay, the mail is the tutorial and stuff right now. Yeah, the mail is yours, yeah. Very nice, very nice. Did you figure out the automation? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the automation's pretty... It, it's kind of the same with Factoria, though. You're kind of, like, back and forward, you know. Just like Factoria, with... this sucks. Beating on iron. Yeah. You're back and you're back and forward between a, a, a couple of things, you know, so that you can you can kind of get it squared away. Right. Um, uh -oh. Am I locked up? What's going on? Well, that was weird. Was that because I looked at this table here a second ago? I don't know. It, it interrupted what I was doing, and I couldn't continue. Yeah. Okay. So it it works. Sure. What is that you're doing then? Okay. Portable miner. Don't we want to slap a portable miner in over there, or are we too early for that? That's what yeah, we're trying to. Uh... Gonna be making one here. Oh, can't afford. Yeah. yeah. I had to go get the parts for it. Yeah, when you come to this at the beginning. What's the, the difference between a crafting bench, bench and an equipment workshop? They make different stuff. Okay, fair enough. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> Is that like a target so, dummy? So, what, what's the deal with the? <laughs> Not too sure. It's just the, the layout. The layout of it. <laughs> it's like AFK C4 farming. <laughs> so, and here's a storage box. This is shared storage, I take it. I assume yeah, so. Yeah, until we can storage. make. Well, I was just gonna throw stuff in it. I mean, don't we need? Don't yeah, that's, yeah. You need iron and there's some wood and some. I'm keeping the flower petals. I've only got one. It's special. I'm holding on to it. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, Jordan? Is stone a thing? No. Limestone is, yeah. A oh, limestone, gotcha. Needed to make concrete. All right, well, I'll smash my face against this iron again for a second. For you, it's one, one in the morning. For Omni, it's uh, getting pretty late, too. It's only 12 for me. Yeah. It's not late. It's early days we're talking about. Yeah, well, late. for normal people, that's late, Omni. <laughs> You're not a normal person. In any way, <laughs> I'm just picking on you. <laughs> just super rude, man. Just super rude. Okay, where's the closest copper? Uh, nice, Jonas Gretz. The copper is a little bit of a haul away. It, it is actually. Uh... Yo, did you go up the hill? So, do I want to make one of those miners and put it on this iron ore over here, or just keep hammering on it? I put two down already. Oh, I didn't see. Oh, they're there. Check yeah. these bad boys out. Remember, I haven't seen oh, any of these equipment or anything yet. Leaves. Press E to open portable miner. Okay. Nice. Is it up here? Slow down, Joe. Joe's building like a mofo. He ain't messing around. Yes. Slow down, buddy. So, is, do I want to smelt any of this or just keep throwing it in the storage box? Uh, yeah, you can turn it into ingots. You can do that at the crafting bench. Yeah. Is there a shift we click? Probably, we should probably make a second bench so that we don't have one tied up all the time. See, add to to-do list. How do you, you just right click it to make it just go? Or Hammer no? in the middle. You hold it down. Oh, there's no way to automate it? Where you can run away? 
There's no way to automate it just now. You have to work towards that. Oh, I gotcha. Right. Fair enough. Do we need plates and rods too, or just ingots for now? Well, if yeah, you check, we'll if you check this right here at the hub, you can click on the objective for uh, upgrade two, and it'll tell you what we need. And I think you can um, pin okay. it too, so it, it keeps track of it. Select milestone. Yep, there we go. Nice. All right, so we need. Plates, rods, and copper wire. Okay, and just like you would think, you make ingots to turn into well, you other things. All the, all the, yeah, all the parts. I got gotcha. you. Yeah. Fair enough, fair enough. I recognize the ingot already from the, the trailer video of a bunch of those going down a going down a belt you know yeah yeah it makes the stuff yeah. really quick for being tier you one to just fill this chest with all the resources and then you can do all the, the upgrades and the crafting um i don't care i'm good with whatever all right i'll put all this stuff in there it didn't it didn't take it does usually doesn't take that loud. like it didn't take me long to figure it out i think you should build up catch on pretty quick to be honest if you just let them kind of okay. oh, it's all good so i don't need uh i'm gonna do a separate series that's edited so it'll be in high definition and everything so i'll go through all of the i mean you guys feel free to ha go ham just if you're doing anything just say what you're doing well, just... that way that people know people watching i just know. figured this way they can see you doing it yeah they can see so you all the resources it. are in the chest whatever right. you need to just get to upgrading I'm, I'm going to be bringing back more copper in, in a second here as well. So that's all we need now is copper wire. There it is. Alright, hub has been upgraded. Congratulations. Beautiful. Let's see what this bad boy looks like now. New buildings and blueprints, which can be found in the build menu and craft bench, respectively. Seventh objective, hub upgrade, conveyor belts. Note, use power poles to expand the power network for optimal results. Note, constructors are capable of constructing copious parts, of which only one type at a time. Okay, you need an actual smelter for the ingots and stuff to automate it, I see. Uh, DD2 was all morning there, killing his fun over on Twitch. i uh, done with DD2 today, though. So now... So we can do, what, hub 1, 2, and 3 in the beta? Um, no, there's like five upgrades for the hub, and then there'll be... I think that's tier 0, and then there's tier 1 and 2 after that. I gotcha. Oh, sweet. Alright, so what's the next uh the next item to make? A smelter or you can check the next Q. Right? It doesn't really give you uh like any direction at all, huh? Well it's if you just Q you'll see the new stuff that we've gotten. Okay, so we so, got a constructor. Yeah, right now, all we can do is automate the smelter. We don't have an automated miner yet. Gotcha. Smelts ore into ingots. We got the stuff for a smelter now. Uh, where do you want to... Where should we put it? Just anywhere for now, really? Yeah, we can deconstruct okay. stuff and then organize it all later. But what I was doing is trying to find a wide open space, and then I used... Uh, concrete foundations and you know made a nice looking factory <laughs> why don't you here i'm gonna throw this stuff in the chest why don't you do the first one here and show me what you're doing oh well, i was just gathering iron and no i mean as far as like laying down the foundation and all that or can we not uh, do that yet more, uh... yeah let me get more limestone nico what's up 
just loading in, Zach. We're we're what? we're twenty minutes into the game right now. So just getting started. If you if you can think like Factorio. See, so these are full, so they stopped. If you think need a bunch of, uh, Factorio, biomass. a bunch of what? Biomass, so like uh, leaves and, and wood. Okay. Just laying around. Yeah. I got I got a bunch by the way. Is that for power? Or... Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, we don't have foundations yet. Dude, you ready for this? I don't know if you saw, but they added that update to Subnautica Sub Zero. Yesterday, they put in a. Like a shark to puss. Oh, 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 shit. Here's a baddie. Coming to get me. Two baddies. Zap. Oh, damn. Zap them. I'm running. Zap them. Oh, they're chasing me down. And it's yep. dark outside. I push V. Your torch. Oh, man. I'm going to die. I died. God damn it. Oh, what? There was two of them. They wrecked me. So did I lose everything? Yeah, you lose your inventory. No, I left huh? a chest on the ground. Oh, okay, okay. And I didn't even see those guys. They were just all up in me. Don't see hmm. any. How do you access the chest? Hit E. Oh, it didn't have an icon for it. All right. I had to re-equip my little my little pokey stick didn't do crap. We get some better weapons. No, not for now. This is the best we got. Right, let's just. Why am I always the first to die? God dang it! <laughs> it's only natural. <laughs> it's only natural. Thanks, Omni. Natural man. Is all. At least I ain't pink. <laughs> You're the first one to go. Anyway, uh, with Subnautica, they put that shark in, right? <clears throat> what am I full? Why is it not letting me pick up anymore? Hmm. I feel like I'm bugged. Or no, okay, it was a buggy animation. Um, they put the the squid shark in, you know, and a new in a vehicle, the truck. So I. I take two hours going around and finding all the materials to make this truck to get down deep where the, the squid shark lives so I can go down and I wanted to go down and record a video of it, you know? So I spent two hours making this truck. It was quite frustrating because the stuff is not where it would have been in the first Subnautica, so you really have to look for the stuff, you know? <laughs> and I make the truck finally. I get down to the where the squid shark is. And the dude comes over and one shots my truck. <laughs> so I spent two hours making a little little water truck thingy just to go get one shot in 15 seconds. And uh, and then the squid shark was bugged and wouldn't attack me. So it came over and one shot my vehicle, but then wouldn't attack me. So I ended up killing it with uh, a dagger. <laughs> it took a while. <laughs> I knifed it. I knifed it to death. Oh, there's iron ore in here, man. So, is all of the iron going to have to be made into ingots before we can do anything else with it? Or is there any reason just to keep some iron ore? No, no reason. Okay. And we don't have a smelter down yet, right? Yeah, we do. Oh, okay, okay. Let me pump this into that. Let's see, where is it? It's right here. Oh, gotcha. The big fancy new thing, I see. So where's it gonna go right now? It's got its own inventory. It's or got I see, an inventory yeah, it's of it. until we can um, until we can make build belts. Some kind of storage or process. One. One. The flashlight's not very bright. How do you... Okay, there we go. Okay. The power poles look cool. What is the range like on the power lines? They're quite good, actually. They're quite good. Alright, so we had to build this biomass burner, too, to get the power, huh? 
Now, how did you create the biomass? Same place at the little workstation? Yeah, that's or? built into the hub. Oh, okay. Gotcha. We get to build a better one later on. So where do you throw the leaves into? You turn the leaves into biomass, and then you put the uh, biomass into the burner. Right, oh, okay. The, oh, I see it, I see it. So it was on the workbench. Yeah, it's on the opposite. It's around the back of where... No, I saw that. I just didn't... I was expecting just to throw the leaves in. That wasn't very much biomass, was it? You have 500 leaves. You guys ain't messing around. I grabbed a whole bunch of that while I was out. What's going on there, Jay? <laughs> it's a good question there. Killing is fun. Why do they? He's, the local wildlife is aggressive. <laughs> Good to see I can still jump on Omni's head. That's important. Congratulations. You have unlocked new buildings and blueprints, which can be found in the build menu and craft bench, respectively. Did you guys make it past the biomass, or are you, do you use biomass power for a while? Uh, eventually, you get to make biofuel. Note the placement of conveyor belts. Caution. Overloading the power network guarantees suboptimal performance. One health. Okay, I see the health bar is at the bottom. So how do I? Oop, I threw it on the ground. Threw it on the ground. How do you eat something out of your inventory? So you put it in your hand, and then oh, you geez, have to. Oh jeez, really? Yeah. I'm actually half health too. Hmm, that's kind of wonky. Used for crafting. It would be nice if you could at least shift click it or something into your hand. Oh, Joe is a building machine. Every game like this that we play, Joe is uh, always uh, got a much larger clue than Omni or I. He just kept on playing when I stopped. <laughs> What are you setting up over here? Is this for copper? That's what? I'm guessing you put this down, right? I haven't put anything down, so... I'm talking to Omni. Yeah. Well, yeah, it's a constructor so that we could feed the iron that I'm assuming it's, you're going to pump from here over into that smelter, which will come over here into into this. So I'm, I'm, putting, I'm putting two constructors down over here so that... You can automate your plates and your uh, like rods or uh, yeah, like plates and rods, pretty much. I'm need the rod maker. <laughs> hey, why is it not going? Oh, because there's no output. I see. Yeah, yeah. Or the no output, output is full. Attached to it yet, so. And we can't make conveyor yeah. belts yet, huh? Yeah, we need to... I did saw in, in that little teaser video that they did for the beta announcement, the conveyor system looks cool. It, how you put it down, it's a lot... It's not like uh, Factorio in that regard. You don't have to clicky-clicky on so many little individual things, you know? Wrong one. That one. What am I missing for about? So, do we need another smelter? We got one for iron. Do we need one for copper as well? Yeah, but the coppers are way over yonder. Like over yonder. It's a, yeah, it's like a black hill. But it's at the top of that right hill. Right there, isn't it? Or is that something else? I I just went and collected it. Oh, okay. It, yeah, it's up that hill though. It's, it's up. What's this yeah, stuff right here? This is limestone. Oh, I got gotcha. you. 
like so yeah it's different gotcha uh, what, what is it again for these damn power poles stuff like this big old rock and all will we be Lime able to stone. like demolish it later Lime i didn't get that far but i'm i'm hoping we can i know that there's a chainsaw for chopping down trees but i didn't see anything for knocking out giant rocks oh i see and i don't get what this big platform over here is for either where this thing I'm standing on here. <clears throat> oh, I just put this down. I'm going to start building this out, and I'm going to move this over here, and this is going to be... The oh, line. okay, I got you. So these are like the concrete pads you were talking about? Yeah, the foundations. Gotcha, gotcha. You can climb on everything. Yeah, moving around feels pretty good. Yeah. I think it's definitely good that they did first person in that regard. It buys them a lot of uh, leeway as far as the animations go. Not having to do like a character animation or whatever. Yeah. Alright, so I'm going to tear this down. It's out of here. That was quick and easy. Oh shit. There's a bunch of stuff, big stuff flying around up there with little babies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah. There's a chance to remove rocks when you use the chainsaw on any plant close to them. I gotcha. I mean, the whole game isn't here, too. So it's only, what, the first three tiers of stuff? see what you got going on here now let me see when I look at the okay we got conveyor belts now uh, we still don't have the miner though nope I'm trying to, I'm trying to think line. ahead yes foundations you're going I see <laughs> so how the foundations you're making with the concrete I gotcha ramps Some cool stuff. Oh, out of concrete. All right, so I'm thinking we'll start the smelters right here. So, will you are you gonna put two smelters side by side, or? Yeah, I'll do iron over here. And then this one will be all iron, or? Just yeah, side, or you'll yeah. put the copper over closer to the copper. Right. Gotcha. I don't think you can, Brandon. I think it's a if you snoozed, you lose type of situation. Where um, you had to be signed up for the beta already and not get a key to get in for the weekend. And like the three of us, we've been bitching about not getting beta keys for like six months. <laughs> so all three of us are pretty uh, pretty excited to get the opportunity to hop in. Oh yeah. Oh, a lot of stuff. I gotcha, and that's smelting the ingots. No power. Okay. Well, it's good. It's got stuff ready to go. So you just have to power. So the hub is where your base power is all coming off of, or does it have to be attached to the biomass here? Yeah, it's going to be attached to that that biomass. the The way that I was doing it is to More cables. Um, set it up with the pole for each one, because there's a limit to how many connections you can do on this concrete. Like each pole can only have three connections. Gotcha. They said you're too low here, Jay. Let me turn you up. I am rods. Yeah. Is, is this actually smelting anything? Or? Joe has been turned up. 
Okay, I got some concrete now. So anyway, um, are you putting it down? Yeah. So like, uh, I'm missing all this stuff. Middle. I just wanted to see what the what it looks like. Oh, okay. So like, set up a pole here, and then connect the generator to the pole, and then from the pole you can connect to two other objects, and then you'd have one connection left for another pole. Oh, you can only connect the two objects, huh? Three total connections. Well, I guess that's fine. Is there upgraded uh, power poles down the road? I didn't see any. I didn't. I don't. I haven't seen any either. Gotcha. Thirty per minute. Can I have a little sight needed? Uh, only a few more. Man, it's pretty cool that they could bring. Like the Factorio type yeah. flavor of game into a 3D environment like this. Uh, where's the limestone? Right there, right? Yeah. <laughs> I need to, Shelly Lynn. I, uh, my PS4's got dust on it right now. I haven't turned it on in so damn long. Boop. It's gonna be Update City when I fire Boop. that thing back up. Like, every game I have on the PS4 is going to have updates sitting. You have to leave it for two weeks. Yeah. <laughs> and we should work on the next upgrade so we have storage. The hub have, upgrade? I'm so close, I'm so close you, to... You just need concrete? Yeah, I'm, I'm doing that right now. Sweet. Great. Didn't change that time. So is this storage box, is this something you built, or is this built into the hub? It's this built is built into the hub. Okay, I gotcha. Alright, so now we have storage. And we have the miner. Nice! We should get the miner going. Gotta check out this miner here. This is satisfactory. Liam, it's like a 3D Factorio. It's from the makers of uh, Sanctum, the Sanctum games. Uh, same uh, different developer office, but same publishing company and everything that did like Deep Rock Galactic. Uh, that might should put hope. Uh, those are the miners. That thing yeah. looks meaty. Yeah, it's cool. Like... Oh, dude. Look at that drill. Holy crap. You probably never got to see the animation for the small. So I haven't seen the animations on any of these. You should, well, run up to one of the small ones, uh, shift click the stuff that's out of it, and then hold it back up, and then just, you could put it back down again so that you can kind of see the animation. For the small oh, for the portable miner thingies? Yeah, like run over to like where the limestone is, like yank it all out of there, like pick it up, or even just pick it up or whatever. Or you can click E on it and it'll say at the right at the bottom, pick it up. So just do that and then place it back down again. Like you just hold it in your hand and point it to the, the ground, and you'll just see mm. the cool. It's, I picked it up, cool but it went there. into my inventory or something. Yeah, yeah. Well, Pick up miner, pretty much. Yeah. Is oh, I have bottom? to. Then I have to put it in my hand. Yeah, yeah. That's that's. I don't like that. Now, how do you place it once it's in your hand? You just you click, just click the ground. Oh, okay. Or no. There we go. I see it. Aha! Like a little mechano spider or something. It's pretty cool. Like, I like it. <laughs> it's pretty cool. I thought it was a spider at first and it was going to come after me. I was like, no! <laughs> oh, I noticed there's like a arachnophobia mode or something. A toggle? I saw that. Is that enemies? I think it might be. I think it might be enemies. Is there, uh... I mean, we're gonna get better weapons down the road, right? I don't know. Some of the things you can shift-click and some of the things you can't. 
I mean, I'm sure that's something that'll get dialed in once they get a little bit closer to launch. All right, here we it's, go. It's not that smooth, but... Oh, yeah, dang. Like... It is putting it out. Okay. So we still need a bunch of plates. And then, is that a, like a storage you put on the other side there, Joe? Yeah. Gotcha. Now, those conveyor belts... Do you have to make the belts? Yep. And then put them in your hand and everything else? Nope. You just click on it and connect them. Oh, okay. See, I didn't even have any belts made, and it was giving me that option. Let me see. You just uh, you just have to have the plates. Oh, okay, image. I gotcha. It automatically does it. Well, that's good. That would have been a little tedious if you had to make every individual item. I mean, that's how you have to do it in Factorio, and none of us minded. But the belt system is kind of cool, the way you can just stretch it out, and then what it uh, takes away the... the required resources, depending on how big it is, or...? Sorry, what? Like when you're placing the belts, I noticed like you can make the belt like as long as you want. Is that based off of how many of the resource you have on you, the plates? It's based on how many in your inventory, but I think there's a limit of sixty. I gotcha. And then you, there are connectors, so you can you know maneuver them around too. So what uh, what do you want me to focus on here? Uh, the hub upgrades. Okay. Just keep upgrading yeah, you could, it. You could you could help help me with what I'm doing here with this. Well, what you doing, mate? The the hub. Oh well, yeah, I can do the hub. Like I'm just uh. Plates and rods. Yeah, plates and rods is the only thing now. Just throw in what I've got there, I guess. Just do this and plates and rods. It's mostly it's just iron now. Just iron I'm needing now. Not a lot of copper. Have you got anywhere filtering for this copper yet, Joe? Or are you just iron? There's copper inside the the chest. Oh, I meant for smelting. Uh, I haven't done instead, it, it's, it's instead of me just manually standing at this goddamn thing. <laughs> Now, with with adding on different stuff, like the copper and the iron and all, do you do it like Factorio style, where you create like a main bus? Yeah, yeah. You can't anyway. I haven't gotten that far, I'm just... I, I just need to play through it. I'm gonna st I, I have a feeling I'm going to end up staying up all night tonight. I'll probably be mm -hmm. a zombie on tomorrow's stream. Mm. I'm thinking there's really not a lot in the alpha. Because I'm already halfway yeah, through Yeah, that's true. There's probably not... Can't get far enough to do all the cool stuff. Yeah, just the basics. I know you can do some pretty cool stuff, actually. There's the, with the three tiers, there's actually quite a lot for you to build. It's actually quite, quite a bit. Alright, so need... Joe's got the iron kind of set up right now, so there should be plenty of iron for us to just kind of filter through that quick, that one pretty quick. Well, I'm making all oh, I've got... I got the hub upgrade right. Yeah. stuff all squared away here. Just need to finish making it all and plug it in. Yeah. Yeah, the alpha like, had six two, tiers, and the weekend is locked to three. I saw that. Well, there's supposed to be eight, but I think we're only going to get six. Six what? It comes back around for... Well, when it goes well, live, it'll all be there. Three. They said the alpha, it's only going to be the six. So the people yeah, that had the have. alpha access already, they'll still have access to the game. You know, once uh, once this weekend is over, 
bunch of wood, actually. You lucky people. I felt a little better about it after it was over, because I was one of those people. I mean, I've been, you guys have heard me complaining in Discord. I've been bitching about it for months. It's like, God, they've sent out so many thousands of keys. How could I have not possibly gotten a key? <laughs> or... Did you see that video? <laughs> yeah. So there was 300,000 applicants? That's crazy. That is crazy. And we, not, not, and three, the three of us were one, the lucky, unlucky bunch that just didn't get a key. <laughs> I don't know a single person that had a key. Out of all the people I was talking to regularly about it, I don't know one single person that got a key. So it's, I mean, well, 300,000 applicants, they gave out 9,000 keys. My numbers were off. I thought they gave out about double that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the trains are still locked. I'm far from that. I mean, I'll go through everything that's available this weekend. Um, everything that's available in the alpha, but I'm looking forward to it launching for sure. Oh yeah, definitely. We could start the real playthrough then. Yeah. This is this is basically the tutorial for us, is being able to get all this basic yeah, stuff. It's just so getting that get little first look, stuff. you know? Yeah. Alright, now where are all these plates going? In the storage. Straight behind you. Just right behind you. Yeah. Oh, I, mean, I thought you meant for the hub. Yeah, I was finishing it up. But I had to make a few more of the plates. Oh, there's still more iron in this chest that can be turned into plates. Well, uh, ingots still is inside that chest. This manual crafting, at least it goes really quick. It's not like, tink, yeah, tink, tink, yeah. you know. It just sits, puts the stuff out. <laughs> the, the noise isn't too bad, actually. For the like when you're crafting it, I turned everything way, way down. <clears throat> After hearing that, the intro for those uh, that have got into the beta that have yet to log in, when you first fire up the intro, it is like <laughs> ear bleeding loud. I mean, I had just had to pull my headset off and leave it sit. <laughs> it was that loud. I could have been mean and not told you about it. Well, I mean, most games I'm, are, I'm very hesitant when I log into any game for the first time. All right, hub is upgraded. Nice. You have unlocked hub feature. What is next? What do we get? We got new buildings. Building biomass burner. Building space elevator. Motivational space message. elevator. Congratulations, you succeeded in every provided task. On behalf of Fixit Incorporated, I thank you for... What is the conveyor <laughs> pole? Message. <laughs> is that for just getting the conveyor belt up off the ground? The yeah, you can uh, elevate it. Well, okay, I gotcha. There to ensure you progress along Foundations, walls. Additionally, the man provides the opportunity to send samples of xenobiology and other New materials product assembly. relevant to R&D in exchange for appropriate... I don't get what the space elevator is, though. Note, future developments I built it, but I didn't get to use it. And thus what does it do? Good luck. I think it unlocks future tiers. You send resources up into space. Oh, uh, okay. Huh. Here we go. Ingots. There we go. I hear you there, Juiced. A lot of people were were pretty upset when they pulled it from Steam. You are not alone. Dude. There was many, many, many upset folks, uh, without a doubt. Oh, we got a little inside now. Ma'am. Ah, it is. Molecular Sorry. analysis machine. Omni, leave it to Omni. First thing he does is study the nuts. <laughs> that's, that's all I got on me. Omni's looking at nuts <laughs> in close detail. <laughs> that's all I got on me. Well, it's just a matter of convenience. I mean, for me, I don't mind. I actually use three because I have Origin as well. So I, I've got Origin, Epic, and Steam. But I can tell you that the only thing that I have set that loads at startup is Steam. I don't let Origin or uh, Epic load up automatically at startup for me personally. If I want to play, most of my games are on Steam. And if I want to play something on Origin or Epic, then I load that up. Going on, dark minded. How you doing? 
these over here or something. Oh, this could look better. Conveyor splitter. Oh, I see. So you got to go through each individual hub, hub upgrade just to get to the next tier. Just to get, yeah, just to get to the next one. I so there see, is I see. Tier. And every time you do it, you you complete one, something else unlocks. Oh, well, there's so lots of got... stuff here I can do then. I see. Yeah. I got this all Ooh. figured out. I got shit all yeah, figured out now. <laughs> Not yeah, really, okay. but kind of. Okay, so this is still doing that. Can I still jam this one in here? Huh? No, I'll need to wait, I guess. Oh, well. Okay, green slug, yellow and carpet, flower pit. So we need the. Just let this there. run here. Yeah. There is a slug there as well, actually. So, uh, uh, what you doing there, Mumbles? Is anyone He's going really, really, you guys really, okay really, for really, health? Really, really, really. <laughs> uh, Look, just because I like to think out loud, okay? What are you doing for health? I'm at full health. I got half health. But you know why? You want you, you want some of these? Uh, do you want some nuts? Do you Joe? want some of these nuts? You want some of these nuts, man? Give me those nuts. Some of these nuts. There's uh, six of them in the chest. I with Origin, I've got it pretty easy though, uh, Zulfri, because I only play like I, I think in the entire history of gaming for me, I've only played like maybe two or three games on Origin. So that uh, aspect of it doesn't really bother me too much because I just don't play very many games there, you know. Need to somehow. Oh no, we still need to. We just need to do hub upgrades and that. To I'm working on it. Now. I'm working on it. Cut me some slack. Oh, no, it's just for the. Um, you want me to just hand over the stuff that I've got so that you can make the stuff? Sure. Throw it in the, throw it in the chest. Uh, I'm manually processing all, all this iron that was in here, <laughs> which is taking about forever. It's not too bad. Like, well, I've already done copper ing like ingots and that for you. There's 300 of them there, so... Sweet! So you're okay there for that. I'm doing yeah, good, I'll just, like, I'll, just throw, I'll just throw all this stuff in here. For, like, just throw the, it all in there. I'm, throw I've it got all in. Uh, like 100, 161 iron there as well. So you do kind of have a little roadmap to an extent. It doesn't, like, say, yeah, make this, yeah. make that. But you've got a little roadmap of what to do. Like if you're if you're at this point and you see these are the buildings you can make, this is what you're supposed to make next, right? Let's see, I need 150 of those. Oh, I love how you can split stuff as well. By the way, so cool. I'll split stuff off of a conveyor. No, like in your inventory, if you right click it, it will automatically split it for you. But in if half. You hold right click on an item, you get a scroll bar. Oh, that's pretty sweet. It's so cool. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely nice. Um, so it makes it easy to grab what it is you actually need. Hell yeah. Like, super, super good. It's good stuff. Please new, choose a new specimen to begin. Barrel nuts added to object scanner catalog. These nuts have go? been added. Yeah, did you? <laughs> <laughs> Terrible. Uh, Just what? plain terrible. That's weird. Oh, this is a little... <laughs> this is a little weird, this. Can I just throw any anything in here or pillberry? Why won't it take the pillberry? Cut piece, flower petals, little nut. Uh oh. Uh. I think the molecular analysis machine might be bugged. 
breaking stuff already, are we? I think it is. Hey, Angel. What's this? Hey, Pedro. Uh, Joe, worry. do you want to come and check this? Check what? The analyst machine on the inside of the building. What's wrong on it? It's broke. Oh no! Wait, no, it's fine. It's 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 working. It's it's working again. There we go. Oh wow! It pumps this wire out quick. I think it's, I think it's t uh, like I was going in and out with the UI like a couple of times there, but it wasn't until I walked away and then came back again and checked it that it actually kind of ticked it off. Uh, if you mm. like games like this, Dark, it would be fun. I mean, if somebody wants like an action shooter or whatever, this game would be mindlessly boring for them. But for somebody that's that likes uh, dealing with the logistics and stuff of, you know, like like the Factorio thing. A lot, there's a lot of comparison from this game to Factorio. If you liked Factorio and you wish that there was a 3D version of it, this is it. Or I mean, it it, it's not the same company. And it's not named Factorio, but I mean, it, it follows a lot of the same, you know, the same type of thing. You. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's cool. Utility is ready for launch. Do I launch it? Oh, sure. I got a big red button. If that's the one you want. What's that do? Utility. It tells you before you launch it, like what you're going to get. Oh. Oh, I thought something was going to actually shoot up in the air. Yeah, it does. You see it? Look, look oh, 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 I see. Hit the big fly thing. Smack it. Oh, it missed. <laughs> What's up with the big... So we got air cows. We got space cows on the ground. <laughs> um, wouldn't it suck if that big old fly thing decided to come down and whoop some ass? That would be bad. This is the worst Pod will return. I didn't ever see what it said it was going to give us. <laughs> is it giving us the technologies? <sighs> uh, yeah, it's unlocking like inventory and uh, upgrades. Oh, and okay, like okay. Push, I get yeah, it. Push Q and then it will. Kind well, of yeah, it hasn't. What is? It's still in. It's it's still launched. I got to wait two minutes. I'm going to mute you guys for just a sec. Uh, I'll be right back. Be right back, all. Sorry. Space elevator. Entertain everybody, Omni. What shenanigans? I'm not singing it again. He didn't. He didn't say this time, which makes a change. <laughs> You're streaming right now, right? Yeah, but the, I don't need. They don't demand that I sing for them, so that's that's, that's, well, good, times. I just said that's good times. That's good times. It's good times. I want to kill just so badly. Oh, I can hit him. What? <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Wait, did, did it actually damage me though? I don't know. Come here. <laughs> oh, it does. Yes, yeah, it does. Yes. I only have four health now. Come here, Jess. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> you as well, Joe. Oh, you prick. <laughs> There's plenty of food in the uh, in the box. There's plenty of food. Yeah, well, right, that's I'm it. Back. Sorry about that, y'all. My Me son was on the phone from Japan. I had to give him the hugs and kisses. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> so was that you guys tearing my ass up while I was down? Because I noticed my health is low now. Yeah, I got hmm. two now. Hey! <laughs> so there is PvP confirmed. Let's go. You ready? You can have low health. I'm half you were hitting me while I was AFK. <laughs> I'm half health after battling Joe there myself. <laughs> it's too the character animations are too glitchy for oh, PvP. <laughs> yeah, that's way too glitchy. <laughs> oh no! Power poles. Oh. Ready go. That Omni's elusive. <laughs> Are you gonna get me? <laughs> you're like, it's weird how you're lagging around all over the place. Like you're doing the same thing. I'm just getting lucky and hoping you come into range when yeah, I. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm charging you every time that you. Oh, I'm just holding down the shift. 
Oh, you got me to get it that time. Yeah, is it working? Oh, no, no, I'm out. I'm need down. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> you win, I yield. I don't see your loot box. Loot box? He <laughs> <laughs> didn't drop nothing good. <laughs> All right, copy. I can't, I can't waste the stuff that I've got on <laughs> Yeah, my son is, he's in the Navy. He's deployed in Japan right now. He's actually about done with his deployment and ready to come back home. He's got just a few more weeks. It's Factory Battle Royale. Oh, the kid, he doesn't need to ask. He knows I'm playing video games. hes If he could, he'd be playing it with me. He's a big fan of gaming as well. He, he took his Xbox with him. He bought an Xbox Slim or whatever they're called, the Xbox S. Xbox One S, and took it with him to Japan. All right, well we got our stuff back. Let's see what we got. It doesn't say anything new. Oh, massive walls. That's all we got was walls out of that deal. So are we ever going to get attacked here? Oh, we got a lookout tower. It's making me think we're going to have to protect the conveyor belts at some point. Could be, huh? What is this? What biome is this? Button again. Oh. Alright, what next? Logistics. Let's... So, we need more plates, more rods. Alright, so it's all. it seems like it's the same basic stuff. So if you had this automated, you could knock this stuff out really quick, huh? Yeah, yeah. It's just a matter of getting to that point. Well, that's yeah, what we're it's, working it's, on. It's right, right. Everything that you can, yeah. So we're starting so to work on it, I got here. you, I got you. It, it's a little different from Factorio, because obviously you'd have to get to the point where you're doing the research and that, so that you can actually do it, whereas this is just, it's all manual crafting, or running back and forward between your smelters and stuff that you've got to set up in the beginning, so... Yeah. He watches them every now and then, not very often. He He works... He's on a flight team, so, I mean, he works ridiculous hours. Like, they'll go, like, a day and a half without working and then have to work for, like, 40 or 50 hours straight. So, he doesn't catch many of my streams. You ever see him, his, his YouTube name is Tipsy. T-I-P-S-Y. <laughs> so, if you ever see some dude named Tipsy talking in chat, by all means, give him shit. So, what is the purpose of what you're doing in here, Omni? If you click this, this here, this, uh, this material kind of thing. If you click ma'am. It's, it's just basically, um, it's analyzing the stuff that I'm putting in there. But what are you getting out of it. that? I have no idea. It's just the fact that I'm on, like, it's something to do. Like, I've just, like. So you're so, scanning stuff and you don't know why? Yeah, like, I I'm mean, scanning that's fair. nuts. <laughs> well, I didn't expect you to be scanning anything but nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, well, right now I'm doing a green power. Like I don't know, uh, you might most green power slug things kicking about. All right, so I see you guys got the rods and everything going over here now, huh? Oh, that's what this is all, Joe. Like this is Joe's this a is beast, all, man. This is all him. Nah, he's on a base. He's on that naval base over there. They since he's on a flight team there, they go all over the place. Like he's. He's deployed to Japan right now, but, like, they'll fly over to Greece. You know, last year he was in Japan, and they went all the way down to South America and uh, did stuff and things, whatever, you know. He's not allowed to talk about that shit. It's all super secret stuff. Do you need a hand uh, with, the like, the, the hub still? I don't know. It's all going. It's just a matter of... You know, you, you, you fucking mules aren't making this shit quick enough. Get going, mule. <laughs> Pardon my language, y'all. <laughs> has everything actually been, like, fully crafted? Like, yeah, okay, so it is. I need copper wire now. Do we have a bunch of copper bars anywhere? Is there not? I think there's just a bunch of uh, copper in the That's what I'm working on here. right now. Okay. <laughs> no, the copper's gone. I'm just picking on you, Omni. The F word just slipped out. I noticed. He's been in for... How long? See ya, Pedro. Seven years, yeah. He's been in for seven years. So, I mean, he's almost... 
he's getting to the end of his deployment. Or getting to the end of his uh, enlistment time. He's still unsure what he wants to do. What, are you trying to start crap with me? What is that supposed to be? Like an emote? You got nuts in your hand? Is that supposed to be representative of something? <laughs> you know, there's a bunch of copper inside that chest there. I'm, eat, I'm, I'm eating them. <laughs> uh, it's all gone already, Joe. <laughs> There, yeah, there was yeah, a bunch of so being used. There's some copper ore. I just gotta get it. I'll get it all crapped. I'll quit watching Omni the Nut Holder. Actually do something productive here. Oh, the copper's a lot slower in here than the iron is, huh? Yeah, yeah. it's got a lot farther to go. Um so I don't you didn't get to really choose, uh, Catherine. It just started you off and put you in, you know. Omni's pink. He ch I'm pretty sure he chose pink just to to please Fisk. So he could get off my back. <laughs> <laughs> it's been What's a day already. It's been a day already. For some reason, it's like really slow on the iron. Over I was going to say, what's going on with production over here? It's really going damn slow. Is it the power? Uh, I don't know. It'd be it. 20 milliwatt. Is it like 20 milliwatts? We can make a biomass seems... burner now if you want to do that. It seems like that's what's slowing it down. Needs here, more it's... juice. It's the speed of the production here. Yeah, like we need more. More of it getting smelted quicker. Man, it pumps these wires out though. Yeah, it's the it's the actual cooking of the ores. Like it's it's two seconds. <laughs> What's going on there, Merlin? Welcome. I imagine there's probably a bazillion people streaming Satisfactory yeah, right now. There's so many people that were excited about the game or are excited about the game and couldn't get into the beta. Well, that in the NDA. Up until today, there was an NDA as well. I'm loving it so far. I've been, I mean, I've been looking forward to this game for a long time. So I'm just, I don't know what the heck I'm doing yet. I'm still learning quite a bit. These guys know way more uh, about what's going on than I do. But um, I'm just really excited just to be able to play it, you know, because it's been such a long wait. Schematic unlocked. Oh, you did it already. Conveyor belts yeah. now merge and split to increase the complexity. It's like stealing the killing blow right there, Omni. I put all that crap in there and it needs 20 more pipes and you go and put it in. It's stealing the killing blow. Thievery. Yeah, I was you're one of the lucky ones there, Merlin. I've I've been waiting months and months and months trying to get in. So that's a biomass burner there. We should be able to make biofuel now, right? Yeah, we can. So we should yeah, grab we'll just need, all we'll this just biomass. This, oh, this, this biomass burner was out of fuel. Both of them are. That's why no, they're missing. I'm, I'm taking it. Oh, okay, okay. I gotcha. Turn it into biofuel because it's more efficient. Yeah, lots of good info there, Javier. He gave a lot more spoilers than I thought. Let me take a look and see what you guys got going. We got copper going over here. We should research the, the conveyor belt splitter next. Okay. <laughs> that's gonna be that's gonna be the pun of the year there, Merlin. <laughs> I'm loving what I see so far. I mean, I'm just really, really excited to to just learn more and, and uh, you know, hopefully build out something awesome. Shoot through this copper where I'm just sitting here. I mean, I was all three of us were big, big Factorio fans, so we've been we've been talking about this game for a while. I think the first time 
Well, you sent me a link about Satisfactory, Joe. I want to say it was probably at least a year ago. Do you think it was that long? It's been a long I time. Been... I think yeah, it was I, about I a year ago. Well. Yeah, it's been a while. And I've been staring at it ever since then. Wondering, why the heck can't I get into this beta? And then realize there's more than a quarter of a million people applied to it. Jeez. They're pretty yeah. far along. Peter oh, Griffin, what's me, up? Yeah. What do we got here? Let's see. Uh, you, you need a hand with the biomass or that there, Joe? Nah, it's not free to play, Peter. It's a pay to play no, game. Uh, so the biofuel, in. how did you make the biofuel? Or I see it, it's right there. Never the mind. crafting bench? Yeah. yeah. You basically make everything from the crafting bench, huh? Alright. Now what did we have next? Which did you say to do next? Uh, conveyor belt splitter. Hmm, I'm not seeing it. We already have them, Joe. We already have it? Okay. Yeah, oh, okay. What after that? Just yeah. just go right down the list, or...? Yeah. Just... I'd say go with the personal... Yeah, go with the personal storage, because that'll open up more slots, and then we can probably do another box. Alright. Stuff like that. Is going. Oh, yeah. It's nice that the research is not painful it doesn't feel painful <laughs> it seems pretty <laughs> yeah. easy you know to just just do the things and get the research I think we're gonna go and jump and grab some some more stuff to stay alive here yeah the 19th it hits early access indeed I mean, as far as final release, they don't know yet. Pick this up. Yeah, it, it officially launches into early access on the 19th, so uh, anybody that pre-orders the game uh, will will have access to it then. What's going on over here with the iron? Is it just slow, or...? It's not powered. No, that'll do it. Why is it not powered? I don't know. Nothing's powered. It's all red. Everything's red. Nothing's well, all of the little. fuel got pulled out of the biomass generators. Like, is the new one going? Like, all, it's like nothing's connected. It's going now, huh? Hmm. Oh, this one's tripping a switch. It's got three. This one has this got. This one isn't connected. Three connections coming off of it. Plus the, it's got four connections total. This one right here does this pole. And there's something glitchy with that, maybe. It definitely feels good so far. I mean, we've run into very little issues, you know. I mean, they we're said to... we were concerned because they said multiplayer was buggy. We're going to have to redo this network, I think. Each of these towers has a max capacity of 20, 20 megawatts. How gotcha. Much is, how much are these things pumping out like? Each one of so the have... these are pumping out 20. I we thought need it to was. have dedicated poles for... For each machine. For like each pair. Right. Oh, that one's off just now. It's throwing a switch. Like the breakers, the, the fuses. Um... How, how, where are you oh, seeing that, that though? I mean, how do you see? It's you over see here. It says it's... on and off with the switch. It says on... pull lever to reset fuse. Right. It's over by this uh, biomass uh, burner here, just when you select it. There's a, like a switch on the left of it. I just turned this one back on. I just flipped it on the it's pole. No, it's, it's, this, it's this over here. It's this, it's this yellow biomass burner here. If you look at it and look right. to the left, Let's this just... is the one that keeps short. We're going to cut all these lines. Uh, okay. We're going to redo the electric. See, like, there you go. See, like, now so how did you cut the lines? 
with F. F can dismantle everything, pretty much, so you have to kind of be careful with... Like, I can't with, even... With the F button. Gotcha. With the F button. Um, let's check. Joe's making the obstacle course just now. That's fair. <laughs> <laughs> There's more. Oh, we've got oh, enough okay. power, Brian, at the moment. Our problem is, is not our power quantity, it's our power distribution um, is whacked. Yeah, you can only do like four connections. Like, um, if you. Uh, I thought it was three. There we go. So those are going again. No, nope. that's the one that breaks, that breaks it. <laughs> it's the, I was going to say, yeah, you're, it's too much, Joe. You got way too much. Yeah. We, too much coming from one, or too much branching out off the too off much the power poles. To yeah, it's too much. It's attached to it. To what? The biomass or the power yeah. pole? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So Biom. let's. Um... So we, we need a it. separate power source over here. Well, we can make one, right? Let's put it... Yeah, we can make it. We can make another one, right? And then just slide yeah, it. Just, so if the... Let's put it right here. If the the yeah. biomass burner is putting out twenty megawatts and or that's a biomass burner as well. Okay, so that's the same thing. So they're just gonna put out twenty megawatts each biomass burner until we get more upgrades. Nice. Additional samples are required. Okay, so we need if you want to do the last uh, sample there, just the inside it just needs a flower petal. Oh, okay. It needs flower power. I got flower if power. Got, if we, need got more, flower. Uh, we need more biofuel. That's what I'm that's what I'm waiting to do right now, Joe. That's what I'm my way to go and grab some more. So Okay, flower petals. Oh, you got to put ten flower petals in. I think uh, it's well, only, only showing it three. Only up one for me, whenever I was having to put stuff in. It says I ten for me. I shift clicked yeah, as well. Shift. I only had three. Yeah, yeah. We need seven more flower petals. Uh, I've got. I've got six. Is there any in the box? Possibly. Oh, there's a bunch in the box. Yeah. Okay. I know. And you just basically wait out the timer for it, pretty much. But then once that's done, um, I have no idea what happens once that's done. So the begin analysis it shows ten of ten. Go back out of it again, like come back at the inventory. Oh, and just like come back out. I see. Yeah, yeah. I heard power click. Um... No, these died. Why did these die? Went too big, too quick, Joe. I mean, down the road, we'll be able to upgrade the power lines. It seems like we should be able to connect more than two machines to one biomass burner. Or is that just we're in Lobyville and we haven't made it there yet? Uh, I think so this needs we need more, to be honest. That's neat. <laughs> the, the amount of production that Joe's got going. Well, we're like in Factorio, you network all the stuff together, and you don't have the limitations per line until much later in game, you know? Mm. You know, Factorio, yeah, I... you start up in Factorio, you throw down 10 steam engines or whatever, connect it all up to one line, and you're good to go, you know? Yeah, I just, I don't think we know what the ratio between each... Like, because he does have quite a few. He's got well. If the generator is creating one, twenty two, megawatts, three, he's got four massive miners connected to that one. That this one is only socket. Sixteen right here. There's, that should be fine. Hmm. You think on the smelter it would show? 
Or there it is. It's four megawatts room. power consumption. Yeah. So we could do five smelters off of one biomass burner. We've also got um, three big masses. But will the poles well. allow for that? Yeah, it looks like it. This is good. What's going on there, Frag? All right, Catherine, take it easy. Have a good night. Is it still not growing back yet? Let's see what's going on up here. I still haven't been up here and checked out that yet. What is that? It was just a little graphic anomaly or something there on the ground. All right, so this is connected to here. Have you guys run around the map to see how big it is? It's 30 kilometers. Why? I, don't, I know the stat that it showed on the the ad. I just mean, have you gotten a feel for it at all? Uh, no. 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 For what now? For how big for the map just is? just how big the world is, yeah. No, I don't know. It seems pretty big, though. It does look pretty big. Right, so this is going to need a separate... Uh, this separate is a beta area. weekend. Uh, Brooke, it hits... It actually launches in early access on the 19th. Ooh, there's a moment. So do we get a way to auto-collect the biomass or the leaves and stuff later on, or are we always just picking leaves? Yeah, I don't know. I know there's a chainsaw. Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. Trees. The problem with the chainsaw is that it uses biofuel. In order to, uh, <laughs> to get biofuel. Uses biofuel to get biofuel. Well, to I'm sure the, the yeah. ratio is probably good. Ooh, there's a big a big space cow again. If I go over to that thing, is it going to kill me? I want to look at it up close. Uh, Not unless you actually pick it. It looks like a leaf eater. It should be friendly. Oh, God dang it. There God no damn dinosaur. it. These little guys are just irritating as hell, though. <laughs> and you can't run away from them, can you? They catch you. No, you, you can't. You can run away. Yeah, you can. Yeah, I'm you running. can kind of dodge. I'm running. I need are. to eat. I need to... Are you I still need, gathering bio? I need bio? to eat me some more. I was, and then I went to look at the space cow, and... I got, uh... <laughs> You got mood on. <laughs> I got beat up by a little space boar or whatever you want to call it. <laughs> it's okay. You feel free to call it a little shit. It's fine. <laughs> that little bugger <laughs> came after me. I don't know the proper names of the of the the local inhabitants yet, there, Merlin. So I'm just kind of making them up as I go. <laughs> Uh, it's called Satisfactory there, Adam. Where'd they go? It is. It's still, it's, I mean, it's early, early access, you know? It's not to a point yet where I think, uh, right at the moment, since it's still being developed, it's, you know, it's on PC only. Alright, so much for checking Great. out the Space Cow. Like it's pretty, like it's a pretty game. It looks like its butt is its head. What? That looks like a tail. It looks Whoa. like it's got two butts. Let me sure. a new creature. I'm not messing with it. Ew. What? Where? Where? Let me check this. Oh, let's uh, let's see. Where's the he's like going all brontosaurus over here? Oh shit! Where's the base? Did you, oh, Did you get lost, Joe? <laughs> so it's like south of the base. God, he's so big and he's got such a tiny little head. South of the base. What up, dude? Who is he? You're a nice big space cow. It looks his little his head looks like a turtle head. Dude is crazy looking for sure. Will he step on me and kill me? No, okay, that's good. I'm on a bio. Oh, ooh, what's this? There's poo going in the air over here. The green gas stuff? Yeah. yeah it kills you. Well, I'm not going to go over there. I had a feeling. The plants just 
the Our space cow is just kicking it in, and he don't care. That dude don't care. What's that? Man, there's poo bombs going everywhere over here. This is not the place to be. I'm getting out of there. Does the foliage re regrow? I think so, yeah. That's good. There's another space cow up there, and then the big old flyer. I don't think that the trees do, though. Alright, let me get back to the task at hand. I've done enough looking around. What's going on there, David? How you doing? Alright, need bars and plates. Um, rods. Whoa, this dude walking on our stuff? <laughs> We're at. Oh, yeah, he is. Fat ass dude. I tell you these colored pebbles are useful for two things dating and creating <laughs> color cartridges. There you go, Omni. You can go date the space cow. I'm over here. <laughs> Move it or lose it. All right, personal storage is going. Nice. Additional storage options nice. have been provided. Nice. Extra space. R and D inflated your Sweet. pocket dimension and developed a personal storage oh, box okay. accessible in the <clears throat> menu. Okay, okay. I've got a mission now. Then it's my job. Go. Uh, Joe, storage box. What? What about it? It's the storage box, man. I I just ventured out and I came back again, so. Storage box. You got any carpy stuff on you? Any, any what? Carpus stuff. Carpy and dead enemy stuff. You got any of that? Uh, I'll put it in the chest. Yeah. A weird alien thing with an impossibly smooth surface. Work in progress. Analyzing this will not give you anything. Uh, okay, that's a no then, you don't have it. Okay. I haven't picked up anything off an animal yet. I haven't been able to kill anything. I've run well, back over to you guys every time to save me. I've, I've I still got... have health. Are you still are you feel health or anything? I'm at half health right now. I just got attacked by them um... baddies. Well, there's still two baddies in here. Those also restore one segment every... Like everyone, like the nuts that I've got on just now will only do half. So if you want to just grab those as well and just munch on all that. Actually, I'll take, I only need one. I only need one and then I'm at full health. So that's a heal over time or it's just instant, right? No, it's instant. Okay, it's instant. yeah. There, I'm at 75% now. I'll leave those nuts for Joe. <laughs> Come get these nuts! <laughs> Joe, you heard the man. Do it. I'd rather die. Okay, Juice, let's go and pick on this guy. Wait a minute, I'm gonna get the full health if we're gonna pick on Are something. I'm going to pick a fight. <laughs> I'm gonna go and start something. Alright, I'm coming. Hold on. One sec, let me get uh, all squared away here. Alright, that's close enough. 9 to 10. Get my pokey stick back. I got my pokey stick. I'm ready. Wait, be careful where we're swinging. We can swing that thing then. All right, we got a bunch of biofuel now. Yeah, yeah, you should have enough for now. Jump and that attack way. tactic. Sonic Hogs, yeah. is that their proper name? I was pretty close. Space Boar is not very far from Sonic Hog. I think I did good on that one. All right, so what we what we doing here, Omni? Is, is, is he over? I think he's over here. Yeah, he's over here. I don't see where you're, what you're trying to kill. Straight ahead, like uh, if you jump and then look straight ahead. Oh, south, south. you see him? You see I him? see him. Right. I'm going to the south. You he go looks to the west. scary. You go, you go to the west side, and I'll go to the south side. We'll pincer him. Just keep looking around the oh, side. Oh, he's he coming. Well. Does he see us already? Or no, no he was. No. Just, that was a random try. That dude looks ferocious, no. man. Yeah. Ready? Uh, I played DD2 Go. earlier, Narcella. Oh, I was way, way still. 
<laughs> oh, he's spitting stuff at me. Yeah, he is. Oh, man, this dude looks like something from Alien. Nice. He got wrecked quick. So did you have Alien to do organ. anything to pick that up, or did that stuff just drop from him naturally? No, I, no, I, pick, I picked that up. Yeah, I picked that up. Dude is freaky looking. Right, okay, we need the little guys. The little guys. Where are you at? There you are. Yeah. There's um, some right here. We are. No, no, no. no, no that's not something. It looks like that's something right. weird. Bauxite. Pure bauxite. Oh. That's a new. I didn't know. I have no idea. Um. Oh, wait. I know where I've seen little guys. Uh, to the northwest. Northwest. Uh, do we have kind of push on this? No, we can't. What's going on over there, the, Cyrus? Over the hill here. Alright. I, I had to meet you guys for a minute. Old Blitz had a hairball going. <laughs> Blitz, my boy. He Don't was, mind me, I'm just he was doing the. He was doing the. Uh, Can I, can I make a mess on your floor noise? <laughs> he he almost never does. It's like he he goes through the motions. Sounds like he's you know, Smeagol. <laughs> and then uh but he then he never never does it. Right, okay, where are you? Uh you'd want to report that to Trendy there, Narcella, not not me. If there's a bug, or pardon me, chromatic, not trendy. <laughs> little fella, little fella. I didn't oh, see oh, one. There, 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 he is. there he is. To the east. I'm coming. The east. <laughs> Charge! I don't see him. Oh, I see him now. Oh. Take that. that, you big... Take that. Take that. Nice. Oh, he got wrecked quick. Oh, behind you, oh, behind oh, you. Oh, oh he's got homies. <laughs> Man, that dude is running, too. That's like some laps. Get back here, boy. Dude is just lapping me. Oh, oh, good lord, man. Pap, right in your mouth. So, I so need... you're not doing anything to... <laughs> I need three more. You're not doing anything, right? The stuff is just dropping off of them? Or are you, like, it's, going it's up and... off them and then I'm just picking it up. Okay. I didn't know if you were, like, need... skinning them or something. We need three more. Did this... I did pick up the one from this guy. There's right? a bunch oh. of them over towards the copper. Is where I got right, okay, well, wrecked yeah, later, right, okay. earlier. Oh, to the... Yeah, to the east then. Okay. How is your health now that we've fought that guy? Uh, I'm 8 of 10. I got the moves down now, man. Yeah, I kind of... I like, Okay, I, I need to pick up these pill berries. I'll go in first. Back. I got wrecked. It's actually a nice good bunch of pill berries there, though. There's no... Meow. <laughs> there he goes, What's yeah. my boy? See, he's instantly recovered. Oh, Jesus. You said his name, that was... <laughs> that was it. That's all you gotta do Let's... is say the B word. Let's... And there he comes. And he gets right up in your face, too. He wants to talk to you. Oh, come on, cat. Yes, Blitz. <laughs> oh, what's it going, boy? <laughs> oh, my God. He's like, I'm doing better now. Thank you very much. She's just sitting here laughing her ass off. <laughs> Thanks, dear. <laughs> Oh, we don't need no more blitz over here. Here's some, uh... Okay. So, yeah, I got it. I got some... I got good. these nuts, if you need them. Uh, oh, he's a good cat. Need, he's he's overly affectionate. It, it, what's that? Do you need any berries? No, I'm all good. I'm at 8 of 10. I'm pretty... You know...
I'm almost Steve, full. I could actually drop these and then you could put... Yeah, there you go. Right there. There you go. There you go. It's better than those nuts that you're munching. <laughs> hey, you gotta, you gotta eat what you got, man. <laughs> Joe refuses. <laughs> Respawn. <laughs> I refuse. Yeah, anyway, he's a really good cat. He's super, super affectionate, which is, you know, of course, when he was a little itty bitty kitten, that was all really cute and all, but now that he's an old man. Look at the little dits on the foot on the Are those actually little guys? Or. It's like little snails or something, huh? Is, is that squirrels? Is that many squirrels or something? You well, can't do anything with them, though. The, one, the little ones on the floor. You yeah, can't. yeah. It's like no like eating the space squirrels. I'll, I'll, I'll just grab them just a second. One second. Yeah, anyway, there was a bunch of them up here earlier. When I got wrecked earlier, it was multiples. But now, I'm not seeing them. Joe may have came and killed them all in his savage ways. Oh, here we go, here we go. Come to me, Omni. On my search for biofuel. I'll be right back. Oh. Oh. Take that. Oh, man. You got wrecked, fool. There's a carapace over here. You me just grab it? I can't do that kind of stuff on stream there in Arcella. I'm actually forbidden from showing any exploits or even talking about them while I'm streaming. I lose my... All those giveaways I do, do for you guys, I would lose all that stuff. It's part of part of my contract. Oh, crap. What happened? What were you looking oh, for? I got a carapace. Was there another item that you were looking for? No, I need... Um, if you've picked up another one, I need two more. I crashed. Okay. I'll keep looking for him. I got it down now how to kill him. Sweet. You gotta avoid the charge. <laughs> My problem is spotting them before I'm right on top of them. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's usually true. What's up, Nicholas? How you doing? Oh, oh, oh. You said the fall damage isn't too bad? It can be. Let me test it right here. Yeah. Oh, there was no fall damage from that. So I guess you do have to be up pretty high, huh? You could go off like some standard ledges or whatever. What's going on with you, Nicholas? Playing this is my first look at Satisfactory, so I'll be doing a full series once this thing launches into early access. But I'm also going to go through as much as I can over this weekend. Uh, so there will be some edited content coming as well. This is literally my very first blind look. Now these guys have played a little bit today earlier, so they know much more than me. But I'm still just kind of checking out the world and uh, the animals and... Getting a feel for it, really. Yeah, just getting a feel for things. Um, as you see, this is what we got going. Joe's at hard, hard at work over here. Joe's slaving away, and Omni and I are running around playing with the playing with the, the at the petting zoo. <laughs> Whacking stuff with our sticks to get the nuts. <laughs> Reminds you of Ark. Well, this let me go over here and show you what we built, and you will instantly not think of Ark anymore. It's it's kind of like I mean it's been oh, the the term has been overused all day so far on YouTube. If you look. There's just a bazillion people using this term, but it's 3D Factorio. That's the easiest way to summarize it, yep. really. I mean, it's not Factorio. It's a completely different company. But if you liked Factorio and you thought it would be cool to do a 3D version of it, this is what you would play. Because this... I mean, this game looks to be completely awesome to me so far. Be nice to Steve, he's under a lot of pressure. <laughs> Alright, I never... Take number six. <laughs> I ended up getting distracted and ran back over to base. See, what do you need those carapaces for anyway, Omni? Whoa. For the research thing? Yeah. 
It is unlocking things for us. Oh, there we go. It tells you when you go to when you go to the the main hub. Let me check my options again real quick here. Here's a carapace lane on the ground over here. Nice. How many do you have? I've got two now. One more then. Just one more. Uh, I don't have a Lava Mancer set up for DPS, if that's what you're asking for. It's going to take me a month to get all the heroes set back up. And remember, I just got finished with Ancient Power, so... Every hero I have is in is in campaign gear now. So no, I won't be playing. I mean, I've got Lava Mancer defenses ready to go, but I don't have a Lava Mancer active hero ready to play. That, to be honest with you, it'll be really low on the list. Playing the Lava Mancer actively is not... Uh, is not fun. It's just not good. Okay, dang it. Well, I found another one, or it found me. I don't even see it yet. But I just massive. I just took a bunch of. Or I just took a big shot from somewhere, and I don't know where. Hmm. I'm back. <laughs> I still don't see it. That, that was, was you. What? What God happened? Damn it! Omni did the hit and run. I saw you there. I just didn't think it was you. Uh, the drive by, the drive by was real. I see how it is. <laughs> right in the nuts. It was so deep in conversation, I was like, I need to take that opportunity. Like, <laughs> I'm surprised they put that in. I, I'm surprised as well. I mean, Joe's going to end up yelling at us. <laughs> he will, yeah. He's, he will, yeah. Just don't hit me with it. I haven't seen another one yet. I think we may have cleared the locals. Okay. I told my wife. She said she already bought the game, but... Oh, oh, uh, Which one? This one? Yeah. But I told her she can't play it yet. She's like, Over oh. by me, Joe. Over by, over by me. Uh, I'm coming. Uh, east. Yeah, east. You ain't gotta tell me no directions. I got a little pink logo there saying Omni. I see you. I see you. Yours yours is ironically orange. Is it? <laughs> yes. Where is it at? I don't see so it. We've got, oh, there we go. We've there got we go. one straight there east, but we also have like one to the left there I'm, as well. I'm going. I'm rushing in. There's, there's two couple, of them right there's here. There's a couple there. Just, there's a couple of them there. There's Sweet. What are you guys doing? Killing baddies. Getting the car piece for the research. The next piece of research. Take that. Yes. Okay, there we here go. Comes. Watching for the other dude. Watching for the other dude. Dude is quick. I'll give him that, man. And he likes to run circles like a dog. Nice. There you go. You need these too. What? Uh, I just need one. Early from you. Uh, where did I put them? What the heck? Where'd they go? Oh, there it is. Alien carapace. Oh, quickly now. There's one more. I threw it on the ground. Grab it. Oh, okay, I'll go okay. kill this oh, one. Yeah. yeah. Come here, you batty. Pop. Take that. Oh, ow. Dude ow. is quick, man. He's agile. Gotcha. Nice. I'll let you take that. It was your kill. Well, I don't care. I <laughs> mean, anything you unlock, I'm unlocking. So it Ooh, doesn't matter more. to me. There's more. There's Do we more. need more? Or are you uh, just killing now just to kill? Because you're like that. You know it's all for the sport. He's got you the know blood thirst. Sp <laughs> um, he's got the, the blood sport. thirst. All right, I'm you coming. You know what I'm happens coming. to the south. The south. Oh, got a ton of wood. There's I two of them. Oh wow, he knocked me way up in the air. Oh, he last hit on that guy, on that guy. What the hell is this thing? Where'd the other dude go? Oh wow, man, Probably he knocked me did. way high up in the air. Oh Found shit, he's gonna kill me if I don't watch it. Oh shit! <laughs> this guy like exploded into green gas, almost killed me. Hey, what's going on there, Bane Games? It's... I'm loving it. I mean, I've been really, really looking for it. I mean, you you know the deal. Everybody wanted into the beta. We all did. I'm 
so excited just to have the opportunity to play it. At this point, I don't know crap about the game. I'm no, in very good. early stages of learning. But um, just, yeah. I'm good. I found a new ore. You'll get more out with it. Yeah, we saw that one we mentioned earlier there, Joe. Bauxite? Yeah, Bauxite. Yeah. But yeah, anyway, yeah, I'm super so stoked cool. just to have the opportunity to play it over the weekend. I can't wait till it hits early access here. What, 10 days or 11 days? The 19th. Yeah. Let's, let's head on back. Yeah, let's head on back. All right, yeah, let's get back. Need. I appreciate that. The, the we didn't need those was... last five. You just had the bloodthirst going. <laughs> let's grab all this, though, while we're... I've been grabbing it the whole time we've been running around, dude. I got so much of that stuff. I'm just grabbing it as we go. Yeah, but I'm I'm definitely stoked. I'm I just still can't believe. I mean, obviously, you know, right going right into early access. Everybody had an opportunity. All those three hundred thousand or whatever had an opportunity to get in and play it. But I'm very grateful. I mean, I would have been happy yeah. waiting till the nineteenth. But I'm so stoked that I had a chance to play it earlier. Yeah, just to, just this, just. Here. I'm gonna grind the crap out of it this weekend. There will be a lack of sleep over the weekend. There's zero doubt. I mean, I'm gonna be going ham on this thing. I just, I mean, every, the game is just awesome. Just the basic concept, not knowing anything about it and not playing into anything in depth, is just absolutely incredible. I mean, Factorio is such an amazing game getting something with this level of detail in a game engine where you can be 3d with good graphics and run smooth nice. well done, it's just it's a huge opportunity i mean i'm convinced the game is going to be massive people are going to love it anybody that likes this sort of game is going to absolutely love it joe's over here doing all the work yeah we just completed tier one so we got two minutes for we do the next one. Okay, so. Very nice. Yeah, I'm on the I'm in the Discord there, uh, Bane. So I will uh, will indeed. We should build that. Um, what's it called? What is it called? Space elevator next. Okay. Now the space elevator is that going to be getting built right off of the. The main... No, you have to place it, and it's really big. Okay, gotcha. I was wondering if we should build a foundation for it. Why not? Make it look all nice and snazzy. Omni, I'll just throw it all on the ground everywhere. Uh, we got plenty of concrete. All right, well, thanks there, Bane. I appreciate you swinging by for sure. Have a uh, awesome weekend. You're probably going to have a busy weekend being a mod. I don't know where to put it. We need a lot of space. Maybe this way. Six plates. Six. I'm only talking to himself. Oh wow, we're getting. We got to scan nuts. It says. Yeah, that's so that it allows you to search for them. So you can set your scanner to look for it in a certain area. Oh, I gotcha. Milestone cost five nuts. Well, I mean that's easy. That's I've got a lot of nuts. I got five nuts on me right now. There's one one nut too many. The nuts are in. Uh, they kind of look like big pistachios. <laughs> <laughs> they look yummy. Pistachios? Are you saying those don't look like big ass pistachios? Yummy. That's exactly what they look like. They're a little little pale. Big pale pistachios. It's the BPP. I can't, I can't put this. I can't put this box here. Um, the foundation. No. Not waiting for resources. Okay, well, there you go. Uh, oh, do we have two? Or no, that one returned already. All right, there you go, Omni. Now you've got unlimited nut scanning. <laughs> no, no. The nuts have been researched. <laughs> What are you putting down? Another inventory? Yeah, but it's like, it's not letting me place it down. Right. Okay. Yeah. Um, I was oh, trying to place what? it. Like you it, can. Oh no. 
in the base and stuff, but it wasn't letting. Like, can I put it on the top? Do you have one berry? Uh, yes. I'll give it to I... me, and then we'll have this all of this tier done. Please, give me your berries. In the in the box. That so was uh, that was a moderator area. from Satisfactory there that I was talking to. By the way, there guys, he's gone now. I think, but Bane Games oh. is nice. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. Swinging by, cool. Okay, so we have so to set up production to go into the space elevator. Is what it looks like to go into the space elevator. Yeah, it's got like input ports. Oh. Can we move this? So we're going to need lots to of space for it, huh? Put platform down. Yeah. What? Who keeps accessing the Omni every goddamn time? Well, you know it's Omni. What? It's not every goddamn time. I make a save. separate bench so that I don't get interrupted when I'm crafting stuff, and then you come and interrupt again. It's Joe's Can bench, you Omni. Back so what do you want next though? here, Joe? Part assembly, obstacle clearing, jump pads, walkways, or color gun? Um... I didn't, I didn't get that far, so whatever you want to use, I'm going to work on the space elevator. Alright, so I'll just go part assembly then. Yeah, I've been in that Discord for like six months. I don't talk there very often, because I didn't have access to the game. I didn't just want to be another one of those guys that was in Discord crying for keys. <laughs> and I know that's what I would have been, so... <laughs> Where's my key at? <laughs> so I've been in that Discord, like I said, for, for at least six months or so. I can make those quicker than they're coming out, I think. Yeah, I'll just wait for them. Oh, here's some right here. Oh, yeah. That was, without a doubt, the golden meme. I still, I popped into that Discord and got in read through the chat, but I just kind of lurked it. I didn't, uh, I wasn't active there at all. <laughs> Alright, okay, I'll use things over here. Hmm. What is the... It's still going. It's just really slow. The iron rods are... It says 15 per minute, but man, it seems like it's going so slow. What are you even crafting with the... Oh, this is a work... Yeah, a workshop. This is the only crafting... What? There's one right here. You see this one? This is the main crafting bench. Yeah. I might break this one in a minute. The one that I'm using. Yeah. Fuck <laughs> up to another part of the map. I'm gonna break it so I can move it back. I, I mean wants it right stuff. here. Just to make more storage. I use water on my what? sky guards, Stark. I my suggestion would be not putting anything on I it can't. though. I can't put it down here. It won't because let me. this is raised. You can put it on the floor right here. Throw it on the ground, honey. Yeah, well, why can't I just move this back a bit of platform down and put it on the platform? Like, I can't do it on this side. I don't think there's enough space to put the It would be much more convenient if it was right here. Just saying. <laughs> <laughs> just throw it on the ground right here. Right here, right here, honey. Right here. Your thing is to destruct it. To construct my thing, so... I'm only going to move back. A lizard doggo? I, I, I'm not sure. Were those guys lizard doggos? Did you quit? I don't think so, Merlin. We got something that kind of charged around like a boar. <laughs> or yeah, we did kill a lizard doggo. We killed one. That was that come freaky here. looking thing we went over. Don't come hit come me. Here. I'm not the one come starting here. shit. Come here. I'm going to kill you too now. <laughs> Trying to drag me into this mess. <laughs> oh my god. Come on. 
you know, oh, I'm yeah, beat your butt yeah, just like last time. Yeah, yeah. Well, I was an innocent bystander, and you came and started it with me. I wasn't me, the hot you was him. Oh, there we go. I grabbed all your shit, too. Here, you can have your zapper back. That's all you get. So, what is it you're wanting to do? You want to put down a personal box on top of a platform. Just put it on this oh, platform. Oh, wow, we need 300 of those guys. Oof. Yeah, but it's it's right next here. Like, this is was just a nice little spot. I destroy this, I put a platform down, and I move this back one, and, like, or even just move the platform to here. Like, Dude, move the bench just over it. such a pain in the ass. No, I'm not. I'm not a pain in the ass. I was doing it until you wrecked all, like, now I don't have but all the stuff. But the stuff was, was already there. Yeah, well, I had to take it to contain you. Like... I had to pilfer your dead body just to get you to settle down. See, like, you literally could have just put the bench in there. And now I could have actually got actually some storage here. That was all. That was all that it was. All right, Joe. All this stuff you built over here, can you just get all of this out of here? Because I want to build a swimming pool. <laughs> <laughs> all of this stuff needs to go right now. Because I want to pull. Literally, everything. <laughs> like I, I could do what I want to. <laughs> lizard doggo. That's fair. It looked like Wine a lizard doggo. I think that's a pretty good name for it. See, it was not. Hard. Uh, <laughs> Omni does not play well with others, y'all. Just so everybody knows. I play well with others. It's just I want to do shit too. Well, yeah, but you do it somewhere else. You could have put that over here. There's plenty of room right here. But oh no. No, I just put made, it down it, made logical sense to just put it here. No, because I took all his stuff. Now he doesn't no, have he the stuff all, to make all it. The crafting materials. Uh, well, so what made, happens so. if? So you have to make your own personal. What do you need? Like, I mean, I I'll put it back in the box. Uh, no, it was not no, in the box. Be. Yeah. Just, so now can just everyone use them? Yeah, yeah. Jesus, dude. All that just to put a storage box down? Are you kidding me? Well, you guys were the ones that were making a big fuss out of it. You know there, what I mean? Now you have four. Did you quit it? I'm quitting it. You're in my way. <laughs> Get out the way, and I'll quit it. <laughs> Uh, That's what it's all about, there, no Rob. Joe, uh, Jerry, Joe carries us in all games we play. <laughs> uh, it's good. It's good, Sean. I'm gonna be doing. A, I'm gonna be recording a high definition um, edited series over this weekend too. That I'll put up over the next ten days um, while we're waiting for the game to launch. But there is literally nothing. That I've I've seen in the game so far that just hasn't made me want to play it more. Okay, so you're just manually putting that in there, then. Okay. What are you talking about? I just I, I thought Joe was saying something about you had to place the stuff in the ship or something. Or... I don't think we made it to that point yet, did he? Are you talking about the space elevator? Yeah. So when I was looking at the blueprint, it's got input ports. So I okay. set up platforms over here for it, and we're going to need to run production into it. Oh, right. So, right. Okay. You haven't done it yet. Right. Okay. But it's going to, I think it needs um, complex items. So we'll probably need a, another tier of crafting. Right. Yeah, I'm working on it. The These pipe thingies make really slow. The iron rods. It's like a super slow process. Um, well, you're unlocking research, and you're un unlocking things as you go. You see, like, one of those guys just hit the button, and that opened up the new buildings for us. So, what I was working on that these guys just unlocked, we're going to see is... We just unlock that item. Um, we unlock this merger. I think we had those already. 
And we had all these wall segments already. Wall conveyor. Hmm, that's interesting. Is that for going... That... I don't understand. Why would you use a wall conveyor if you could just throw it on the ground right there? Or is that just to elevate it or keep it... If you had conveyors going up and around... Oh. I think the wall is... you go. It goes around the conveyor to... So, what, like, if you had a tower, you could belt your stuff up to the top of the tower or whatever. I'm just wondering if we turn on that arachnid mode. Arachnophobia. Our stuff. Like, maybe there's spiders that... I don't know damaged. what it means. I mean, we'd have to... There's one way to find out. <laughs> so, we just unlocked rotors that we're going to need to... Basically. I'm sorry. We unlock the assembler and the rotor. We're gonna yeah. need those for the space elevator. Okay. So we want to automate that, the making of this. Oh wow, this one's gone for five yeah, minutes. Chainsaw. Now we didn't. Um... We didn't do, like, a main bus type setup. Like, no. So you just don't do a main bus type thing? I, I don't know. Like, this is as far as I got. Oh, I gotcha. How far did you get, Omni? I, like, like I said, Joe's got as further than I did. So you didn't get this far in yours? I I didn't get this far, no, because I, I just stopped. And what is this? This is a splitter? <clears throat> oh, yeah, yeah, I see. Splitting it off right there. God damn it. Some of the stuff it really pumps out, like the copper, the wire and stuff. It's just, man, it's just spitting those bad boys out. But then the, like those, those iron rods, man, those things go so slow. Yeah, that's why I tried to separate the two to make the rods and the plates at the same time. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it almost seems like we've got so much iron coming in. The iron is just backed up all the way to the... All the way back, you know, and, and the conveyor is stopping. So, I mean, it almost makes makes me think we could split off of this somewhere to make... I'm assuming we would need iron for the rotors, right? Yeah, I'm not the overclock building. Let's see. Where are those components that you're talking about, Joe? Like, if I'm looking, if I hit Q and I'm looking through it, like the rotors and stuff, how do you look and see? Uh, well, they're craftable. On the, we haven't unlocked it yet, I don't know. Oh, okay, okay. So, or no, we did. It's part assembly on the... Choice. I'm not seeing it listed as one of the items, or do you have to... So, the assembler is listed under production. I gotcha. And then the assembler would be required to craft it. The assembler probably makes the... Yeah. Here we go. It's, uh... Screws and iron rods to make rotors. And it's three rods to 22 screws. I'm assuming the screws probably craft really quick. Oh, there it is. I oh, and screws cost iron rods to make. So we need massive iron rod production. What's this power shard for? It's almost kind of the same for like gear and stuff that you kind of need for factorial, like modular. Yeah, factors. yeah. It's almost like, yeah, you need power shard. Green power shard. to make the rods and then the Is rods. that another type of fuel? It doesn't give you the a description on it. It would be nice if there was a little tooltip or whatever that told you what the item was for, you know? I mean, I guess we'll run into it. Ooh, incoming message. That was me. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. What? What was that? The that blueprint is now accessible in the hub. 
That was. So, what did you wait for the pod, though, right? What's that? To make a rotor? To make a rotor, we need screws. Screws on screws on screws. Uh, rods and screws. Well, that's the thing, and we need rods. We need rods and screws to make a rotor, but we need rods to make screws. So we need a whole crap ton of rod production, it seems like, as slow as they go. I don't know what we could do. Okay. We can switch this so that they're both making rods. And like the, if we look, you look at the belts, the iron ore itself is, is backing up. It's stopping. That makes me think we could possibly use one more smelter. Here we go. Or do you think that's not realistic? No, yeah, we probably could. It's, we just have to figure out the whole uh, power issue. Right. So yeah, like a third smelter over here. Because I just changed these two uh, constructors to make rod. Did another. I'm going to throw this down right here because I haven't built anything yet. <laughs> yeah, cool. should probably go one more God out. dang it, I put it in the wrong spot. Or no, I didn't. Tree. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. It won't go, it won't eat the tree? No, the tree will stay there. I mean, I think we can place on on top of the tree. It just won't look all that great. Oh, I gotcha. Well, so chainsaw. Can we chainsaw that tree down? Uh, yeah, I think so. Do we have chainsaw? I think we still need to research it, but it's the next in the next pool. Oh yeah, obstacle clearing. What do we need? We need crap load of rods. I don't have very many. Oh, we're six short there. We actually almost have it. We need what? We need more iron. Boom. There you go. Yeah, we need more iron being made, huh? Now, how close these, t like the tiles for the platforms, is it? Let me just look at it. Let's see. Okay, so you can't really put it. Or actually, you can put you the go. stuff pretty close. You, you just need to hit the button on that now. But do you want to? Like each foundation tile, do you want. It, it looks like you could fit like three smelters on two pieces of foundation. Or would you want that though? Or would you want it spread out a little bit more? I mean, you got the whole world, you know? Yeah, I just. I spaced it out so we can move between. It seems like spacing it out would be a, a better, a better plan. Because you've got to have the, the the electricity plus too. Right. <clears throat> uh, these two iron production things, like, have you Milestone converted reached. these over to do rods? Both of them. You are now capable of yeah, they're doing rods right now. I'm gonna expand what I'm about to do screws. This way we can start making rotors. Oh, uh, well, you can always do that there, uh, KX. But we really should sort out the iron situation. It seems like we've got a sufficient amount of ore. Yeah, we're just not smelting fast enough. Right. Now, later on down the road, will will we have upgraded smelters, I'm sure? I think our smelters are upgraded. We unlocked... Oh, there's two more tiers. Oh, I can't place on this. Oh, there's clock speed. You see the clock speed? We can overclock them. Really? Yeah. Is that what we've, is that what we've been done yet, Joe? <laughs> Where do you see that? It's down on the bottom. It says clock speed when you open the smelter interface. Oh, wait, what is that? Oh, the power shard. So we need to kill... Or we need to collect some of those... The green ones? Is that what that is? Any tips? Well, I can tell you it's laggy on PC2KX, so it's not... 
it's not like going from PS4 to, to PC is a fix for DD2. That's a big part of... I mean, DD2 is just not optimized. It doesn't run well. That's a big part of why they're wanting to do the Awakened thing and go to a better game engine. The problem is, is DD2 is like pushing the limits of a decade-plus-old game engine that's completely unsupported. And that's one of the biggest deals of why they want to move along and get get future generations of Dungeon Defenders going. So, I mean, to be honest, I personally wouldn't really suggest someone change from one platform to another at this point, unless you just really want to. If you really want to, then you're just going to have to do the same thing over again that you did on PS4. You would have to just do it all over again on PC, you know? And we, I mean, you know how grindy the game is as it is. So, I mean, it's it would have to be just a choice that you made to start that grind all over again. Okay. Just need two. There's a ton of those down here. Uh, the green one you were saying, right, Joe? What's that? The green the slug? Green, power, green green power thing, we, right? Is it a, a creature or is it the collectible? It's the collectible. I'm gonna go at the top of the north. North Mountain. Kind oh, of I'm thing. missing the iron rod still. God dang it. There's a bunch of them that I kind of crafted up and put into the, the container, like the actual storage container. There's a bunch of them now. It seems like the... Or you put those that in there. Me. I gotcha. Yeah, it was me. Yeah. yeah. Just because it was kind of slow, so I was like, well, manually do it then. There's oh, another smelter, but we kind of have to make a choice on the ore going in. Uh, it's got to be iron. <clears throat> no, I mean how we're gonna do it. I mean, do we want to try to? Is there a way to like combine and then split to like even out the belts like you would in Factorio? Because we've got um... a ton of ore coming. Well, just I would just add a third miner at the. Oh, here. okay, I gotcha. Fair enough. Let me do that because yeah, I haven't chainsaw. put any of the belts or anything down yet. I don't really understand how it works. Oh, you got a chainsaw. I wonder what kind of damage that'll do to Omni. <laughs> <laughs> it's. Uh, Did you try to chainsaw down a tree yet? Yeah, I chopped down the tree that was blocking over. Oh, here. nice. Did it just cut right through it? Mm -hmm. yep. Who's that dude? Nice. I wonder if it works on rocks. All right. No, it does not. All right, I need one of the portables first. Nice, you got pretty decent jump height. You can get over top of those uh, <laughs> those belts and stuff, no problem. Right. Get rid of that tree. Like you get a little low grav gravity or something going. I'm gonna leave the chainsaw on the chest. All right. This way, anybody can use it. Come get wrecked with a chainsaw, Omni. All right, and then it's just one iron plate per little tile of belt that you're going to use. I see, I see. Oh, wow, that's kind of cool that you can just put it all the way over. Oh, how come it didn't go? Oh, there it goes. 
<coughs> oh, that's cool as hell. <laughs> now, I can't split power off of this miner to bring it to this miner there, right? Like, I can't chain these miners together? Well, we have to calculate, like, how much is being used. How much does one miner use? I think this one's full. One miner uses 5 megawatts. And there's 20 megawatts that's going through the power pole. So there's 5, 10. So this already has four connections. That's what I mean. Could I take a connection from this miner and just bring it right over to this one? Why does this have four connections? There was something glitchy with them earlier. I didn't know if it was just graphics or what, but it was showing, like, multiple connections going around. Yeah, okay, so... be able to do this. Let me go see... Now, how, do you, how are you doing that? You're just interacting with the pole, or...? Oh, you see your the, the bar at the bottom? You've got one as a pole, two as the power connection. Oh, okay, okay. I see. So you're just hitting two and it's going. Now we're just going to have to think the power over here, though. Yeah, now you just need to set up a, another a storage container and then a, a constructor for plates. Well, I mean, what about... Uh... Okay, so we got to go plates to rods. Well, we've got these two making rods. Okay, those are both switched over to rods now. Yeah. So this one will be plates. I got it. Now, wh what about the power for this one, though? We would yeah, need we'll a different to, generator, right? We'll have to recalculate. This pole has got two coming off of it, but each one... Alright, so this one's providing 20, this they're using use four. Containers. It should be one, one generate, one biomass burner should power five smelters. There. Sweet. That one's powered. Wait, it's red. Well, I haven't selected anything on it yet. Oh, iron. There you go. Okay. There we go. And then should be okay for the next. If you use this pole right here. And then we'd use a constructor. Well, do a uh, do a storage unit for and then use a constructor. Oh, way, okay, storage. Get backed up. Right. <clears throat> it actually looks like production gets or I see what you're saying. It would get backed up from the smelter. And this way we're storing up iron the iron bars. Yeah, because we've been taking ingots. Yeah, I see what you're yeah. saying. So... And that would be... Organization... Storage container. Oh, neat! You can stack them. So we need four. Wait a minute. Getting ahead of myself here. This one needs screw. <clears throat> the constructor. What is Hmm. Reinforced iron plates and cable. So we just make those manually? Uh reinforce, yeah. We don't have uh, we don't have that automated. Gotcha. So that's making screw. Man, it seems like you could cover a large chunk of this world. So 
also need screws. How many reinforced iron plates was it? Let's see. Keep running out of stuff. Three. Need more screws. So there's those. Oh my god. And then cable just comes from copper, so that's easy mode. Alright, there we go. It is nice that you can just select it and toggle it on and off to track, you know, the individual items you're making and whatnot. Nice if you could scroll out a little bit to line the stuff up a little better. Encroaching others' clearance. Hmm. How did you get that so spread out? Oh, because this one's overlapping onto that, I see. The constructors are pretty wide. Man, they did make it super intuitive, like connecting the conveyor belts and everything, though. They did a great job with a lot of that stuff, for sure. We're wanting to make iron... Oh, look at this. Crap. I put it... Where is that, dude? There we go. Where is he? Yeah, there's that dude, but where's... That's the just track of the... So then this one needs power now. Here it comes. Wait, okay, we're running, we're running back over there. Oh. All right, now how much do each of these take? The constructors take four megawatts as well. This guy's turned me around. Where is he? There he is. Now I'm thinking we might need to set up another um, biomass generator to do this. As oh, I need cable. Maybe, but or that one's got one, two. Can I do anything to that? Yeah. Three, four. I can fit that other constructor on this one, on this oh, no, no, biomass no. burner here. Oh, there was two of them. That was like. Need some more of that cable. Dude. Almost killed me. I got nothing left now. Is it? All right, there we go. Uh, uh, this guy's eyeballing me. <laughs> you got baddies yeah. up on you there, honey. What does this guy do? This is not making. Ew! What's that? Oh, there's no. Power. That's the assembler, huh? Are you friendly? So this biomass burner that these all of these oh, no, no, assemblers no. are attached to and these other two assemblers. So this one is full. I mean it'd be nice if you could mark it. <laughs> yeah, that's not a that's a it's great a build, Ethan. The if it's you went defense rate, rate oh, no. instead of range though and took it to chaos eight oh, no. you would get more range out of a deadly strikes a gilded deadly strikes than you would that mod 
You need help there, Omni? You getting doggied? Uh, uh, no, uh, no, I just think no, no, I didn't do nothing honest, I swear. Gobu, Gobu, you did not see that. Gobu, you did not see that. You don't, you don't that. pissed him okay. off now. You, I, you did not see, no, I don't want to jump in just yet, actually, because oh, there, 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 that, I need to get that first. That's the, that's the point where I'm going to, no. Actually, I'll probably jump off over there, to be honest. All right, so now we got screws being I want, made. I need to get this first. We've got rotors being made. Nice. I need to grab that first before I jump in. But yeah, I'm totally, I'm totally doing it. Like, I'm totally, yeah, like the high points over there. So I'm back to that side again. I'm definitely anxious one. to see Look what you can do in like multiple stories. Wow, that thing is huge, Joe. Holy crap! Why yeah, is that? Do you need more foundations down. down or anything? Yeah, I probably will. That is one like big, that. big, big thing. Holy, holy smokes! I, I, I don't think I can swim. I, I really don't think I can. It'd be a waste to lose these. Like these are pretty important right now. Six rotors per minute. I want to see how you did this. I'm gonna do it for just for you, Gobu. I'm gonna do it just for you. I need to find me another one, though. <laughs> the screws, the graphical the screws is, is awesome. Yeah, like he, he straight up just... Uh, uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. You need help there, Omni. You're getting killed. Nice. Now, now, all of a sudden, these things are just spitting out of here. Now, that's because that's coming out of storage. They're still going in really slow. Uh, uh, I'm stuck on the ground. I'm not actually swimming. I'm going to drive. So now, where do you get those power shards? <laughs> Mucus from the power slugs compressed into a solid crystal like shard. Yeah, I'm just looking for power slugs. Uh, well, I mean, how are you getting is... those, though? What are you finding to get them from there, Omni? I'm coming uh, over to where glue. you're at. Green glue. Green what? I'm, I'm, I'm over here is like super, super pretty, like super pretty. Not for it's long. Like, We're about to it's... smog it all up. <laughs> <laughs> can I, like, can I hold this? The terrain does look pretty amazing. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. <laughs> Crap, I should have brought the chainsaw with me. Or do you already have it? It's in the box. It, no. I don't have it. No. I figured Omni would have snagged it. You know what? I'm still a ways away from you. I'm grabbing it. I want some chainsaw action in my life. <laughs> How do you go down? Okay. Well, well not let me go down anymore. Control? Wow. You need a lot no. of stuff to make that space a Shift, no, it won't let me go back down again. Oh, it looks like I'm, I may need to reach the end. Oh, perfect. There's more, there's more survivability right there for me. <laughs> now, why is it rotors that you oh, want to feed into the space elevator? Is that just what the space people want? <laughs> It's what the elevator wants. It's what it has set as, as the input. Nice. Oh, okay. So rotors and, and something else. I, I forget what it is. That's just what it uses. I gotcha. It's what it ships out. Right. Alright. Oh, look out. Chainsaw action incoming. Oh, man. If I could have rolled on that guy. Oh, no I power. Need... <laughs> I need some... You need biofuel. Biofuel. You know what we should do? What's that? We should set the ore to go into a uh, container before they go into the smelter. Hmm. Oh, there's the way up again. Okay, that's good. That's at least something. Put the ore into a container and then into a smelter? I mean, that makes sense. Well, then you could just pull from one place, you know? Yeah. Well, I was thinking then, because like right now I want uh, I don't have enough iron. Oh, 
Come on, they say they're hot. Let's see. Nice. That was exactly what I needed there. I mean, how how will it be in, implemented where you can automate the biofuel production? You got like big ass lawnmowers going around. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> right. Unless there's a different resource like coal, a coal, but it, it was uh, it disappeared as soon. As right. Maybe there's oil or something. I know there's definitely coal. I saw uh, a little gif that some dude had put on Twitter, and he had coal going all over the place. So, I mean, there's, without a doubt, there's coal. Now, how are you getting those power rods on me? It's, uh, it's just green glowing. Oh, you're just finding them in the world? Um, it's basically just adventuring, yeah. And What's going on, on there, Trilus? How you doing? Well, I'm going to come to you. I want to see what one looks like. I'm just having a little too much fun with this chainsaw on the way over to you. <laughs> Is this a... or something here? It looks like one. Yeah, limestone is pure as well. Oh, I'm doing good. No complaints. What the hell is that? Uh, that was laggy. I didn't get it. You guys got a little lag spike? Yeah. Hmm. I wonder if it's the chainsaw. Ooh, that's a long way down. Can you jump off this cliff into the water? Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 what? Where are you? I'm up on this cliff, right across the lake. I can't see you. Well, you don't see me on the map? No, or I'm saying the... I can't see you. I can't see you can't... either. You don't see me? Jump off. Look down before you do, though, because there is a couple of platforms on the bottom. Uh, I'm in the pool. Uh, let go of shift and hold I wouldn't put... Right top of anti-goblin on anything anti-goblin is one of those mods that's just not gonna it's an unused thing i mean it would still work wow you get really slow through the water huh let go shaft i did and just hold hold space bar no just stop moving altogether and just hold space bar. oh i guess i see i see hello <laughs> i don't see you so did you say there was swimming <laughs> I'm right here, man. Yeah. Oh, I see you now. Yeah, I'm in. I'm in a big ass lake right now. I'm in a sea cow, yeah, and looks you know, like I this. I found a cave near us, but I was kind of afraid to go in there and explore. What do you think of the view though over here, though, with like the? Oh, it looks like... nice. I mean, look at the water. <laughs> the water looks looks very nice. But look at this over here, though. I found a different area. Well, I, I need to get up out of the water first, Tommy. Give me a minute. I'm still paddling, dude. I had to swim across this whole lake. Paddle quicker. Insert more coins. I got the doggy <laughs> paddle going. I'm just barely moving. <laughs> bleep, bleep, bleep. <laughs> yeah, oh, it's like a little it. beachy desert type thing, huh? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like, <laughs> this would be a good base place, no, though, no? Like, it's like, well, oh, there's not many there, resources. Just, just straight uh, to the east over there. The pink dude. The pink dude. It's a dog. Oh, I see it. Let's go kill it. It's a, it's a it, no, it's a dog. <laughs> it's a friendly it's a dog. dog. It's but the only problem is like I walked up and whacked it. So so you it hates you now. It. How do you, you pet to, it? No, you have to run up. And pet, uh, you just have to hit E on it. But this thing is gonna kill me, isn't it? And you're just trolling me. No power. No, but I think you might. It's have swimming to around. Something for it's swimming away. I think you uh, do. You need food or something. Around. I'm gonna guess, catch uh, it. Can you bring back biofuel? Yeah. 
He's just going to run away from you. I think he may. Well, he's running into a wall, so he's going to be stuck here in a minute, and I'm going to either die or. I think you need to lure him with food. I'm not too sure. Oh, no, he's still. Oop, press E to pet the lizard doggo. Yeah, this is what yeah, that guy yeah. was talking about earlier. You can have pets? Yeah. I remember seeing that in like the teaser videos back months ago. Dog. I can't get it now. It's just straight up backing away. He just, just keeps running. Yeah, he, he's like, too like, fast. It's a waste of time. I'm pretty sure you need something to lure him for. The, the pet on the need some seat. meat? He wants bacon. I can't blame him. He wants a piece of the gobu. I want some gobi bacon. The base bacon round. God, the swimming is really slow. Are you on the surface again? It doesn't look like you. Yeah, I'm up here. Oh, no, yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. I'm kicking it. Stroke away, man. Stroke away. <laughs> so there is a... Exp I mean, finding those power cores seems... A How many have you found? Any? Uh, a couple. Let's <laughs> see how this chainsaw does against this tree. There's a body over here that you can test on. You found a couple already? Yeah, there's a body. Uh, that's what I've been looking out for. There's uh, another one of those. Them. There's something rushing you right now. <laughs> Yeah, get him. Use it's a spitter. Okay. Oh man, he spits at you the whole time while you're chainsawing him. The chainsaw is not an effective uh, weapon. <laughs> he running. I mean, he's tearing me up as I'm sitting here chainsawing him. Is that the game you're talking about? Mm-hmm. Ooh, ow. What are you printing? Okay, that, cha yeah, that chainsaw is laggy. I can see you kind of... He's tearing Whoa. me up, too. Okay, well, switch out. We'll distract him. The chainsaw was pretty expensive. Saying. <laughs> oh, the chainsaw's fine. It's The chainsaw's plenty healthy. It's just I'm not. <laughs> I know, but if you die, you drop the taste. <laughs> well, Omni can just pick it up, though. Won't he be dead, too? Well, I mean, if both of us die, we're screwed. <laughs> That's all right. I got me some more blue pistachios. Some blue oversized pistachios I'm chowing down on right now. Sweet. Uh... All right. Enough chainsaw fun. I'll save the biofuel. It, well, show me the next one before you pick it up, because I want to see what it looks like. Yeah, yeah. Wow, that's a it's big like old... A, it's like slime or ooze. Like, it's bright, bright green. Bright, 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 luminous green. Oh, God, I cannot... I can't leave this here. i got to use the chainsaw on it. <laughs> All right, the chainsaw's not retired yet, Joe. <laughs> I think I got everything ready for Mycelia... Ice. Within the fungus suggests strong bonding features. We got super glue. We got space super glue. Alright, is everything working? Looks like it is. That's actually a long way to go for some of this stuff. It makes me think that exploration oh, will definitely direction. be a big part of the game. Did you this find it the with the scanner? No, I found I was chasing Omni the whole time. I haven't been able to. If I hold C, it doesn't give me an option to look for anything. Just or. Just or, and that's it. Or, or, and limestone. Like, there's nothing. I, I need an upgraded scanner or a new scanner or something. Just because. Or... I think we need to research this stuff to be able to scan it. Well, you have to build a scanner and then you. Build a scanner? Yeah, you can We've, build I've one. I've already got a scanner, though. Well, we started with a scanner, right? I mean, I'm yeah, scanning. Yeah. I don't. I never built a scanner. Oh crap! There's another one of those things, Omni. The aliens, like the alien aliens. Uh, there was like three or four of them, I think. <laughs> Thanks for leaving me here with them. Appreciate it. 
hey, you're the one that came up and joined me. <laughs> I never said I'm going was... back then. <laughs> it's going to be that way. I never said you should have. Yeah, I mean, and Goblin, the problem, the thing is, is Goblins just die really easily. So, using an anti-goblin, the mob that already dies really easily is going to die easier. But, I mean, you just don't have problems with goblins. I mean, it would help you out against, like, the, the shieldies, the vanguards, the Chaos 1 enemy. They're goblins. So, you'd get a little benefit there, but... I should have a ton of biofuel when I get back over to you there, Joe. I'm bailing on Omni because he's going to be a douche. Okay, what's that? that. The bi it does, this chainsaw actually doesn't go save. through very much of the biofuel. Oh, crap, man. How am I going to get back up there? Did you jump off the cliff too? Far the f if you no, I fell off of it. Left hand, go far east. Go far to the east and you can go all the way. There's like a ramp that will take you all the way back. Yeah, see, I just I just disagree with that 100%. I mean, anti-goblin, in my opinion, is a complete waste of a mod space. I mean, I had zero problems with goblins dying well into three floor 300+. plus. I mean, any mod is going to be a good mod. Anything you put on is giving you a positive benefit. So use whatever you want, but I personally would definitely never use Anti-Goblin. Oh, I see it. There's a ramp going up over there. Yeah. But, you know, like I said, any mod is a good mod. There's no such thing as a bad one. They're all going to add something to your defense. I would use a Gobu Boom before I used the Anti-Goblin any day, though. Because Goblins just die. I mean, it's the weakest thing on every single map. There's nothing weaker than a Goblin, you know? So you just, by using it, you're focusing on killing the weakest enemy. Oh. Hopefully I don't fall off this cliff again. Because that is going to be a long-ass swim. I'm heading it back over there now, Caden. We're just really getting started. We were looking for power crystals, but Omni's just kind of running around doing his own thing, so I'm just going to leave him alone. I'll bring, the, I'll bring the ones that I've got back. That doesn't help me out. I wanted to know what it looked like on the ground before you found it. <laughs> I'm getting just wrecked here. Shit. It'd be nice if there was a way to hop swap. Oh, I'm dead. God dang it. I'm going to die with the chainsaw, too. Let me run. Run, run, run! Ah, uh, too late. I'm dead. There will be a waypoint going back over to my loot box yeah. there, Walter. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I can see it as well, actually. I should be fine, then. There's just a bunch of them. Trying to outrun when there's too many of them is just not a huge help. Thing needs reinforcement. Oh, I wonder if you could slot reinforced armor on that, on, that, on your chest piece. Well, if it's got a chest piece, it's got to be for something. I've been trying to slam stuff in it, but it's not been doing anything. <laughs> your loot box icon's like a... <laughs> it looks like... Who's the dude from Futurama? <laughs> <laughs> right? Zoidberg? Zoidberg. It looks like Zoidberg of Zoidberg oh, Skull. <laughs> oh, I was pretty close. That's awesome. Not too far of a run. I got the. I've recovered the chainsaw, Joe. <laughs> Success. Oh, did you die? Oh, I got wrecked. I just had way too many. I was trying to outrun them, and outrunning them was just not an option. Let me get all healthy again here. Big blue nuts. Anti-goblin usually sells for really, really cheap, Ethan. I've seen them as low as like 100,000 for a 10 out of 10. Oh, 
Huh. This mycelia stuff, the glue stuff I was talking about, it says you can put it in biomass burners too. I don't have any more food related items. I'm just gonna head back. Yep, that's towards Omni. There we go. That thing is enormous. Oh my god. You can't go up in that, can you? Oh, I don't know. Holy crap, dude. What? You missed. Oh, I hear you. Jesus, that thing is enormous. Crazy big. And it takes the most complex pieces. I'll be right back. I gotta walk around. My legs hurt. Fair enough. I don't think I'll have too much longer in me. I'm gonna have to... My wife's gotta work tonight, so she'll be... She'll be getting up and doing her thing here before too long. Let's see. You said you needed a bunch of biomass, Joe? Or biofuel. I got a crap load of leaves, so I should be able to make a lot. I just, you're not that far away. From, I'm not that far away from. I'm at the back at the base. I'm not running all the way back out there again. I'm literally just over the 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 mountain next to the base. I'll figure it out on my own. I'm pretty sure I could just drop one of these in front of you anyway. <laughs> well, would it look the same as when they're? Pro yeah, probably. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Seems like you'd want a weapon or something. Oh, damn! You know. What the hell is that thing? Joe's making all the fancy stuff. That almost looks like something of a truck. Fuel. Well, I got a bunch of biofuel here, Joe. Just throw it right in all the all the reactors. Or... Hello. Everything changed. What's going on, Michael? I didn't see you yeah. sneak in there. Yeah. How you doing today? Well, at least the biofuel is pretty easy to come by, you know? Did you find a lot of wood? Um, I, I had wood, leaves, you name it, I got it. I mean, I, I mowed down quite a few trees with that chainsaw. Yeah, it seems you get the most from wood. I just, I had so many leaves. I mean, by the time I got back, I had like 2,000 leaves or something ridiculous. That's what it looks like? See, I would have never <laughs> guessed that that's what it looked like. What? It, it, it glows, though. Oh, did you put a power cell in the, the smelters? No. So, Oh, you make the power cell from the slug? Yeah, I think that's what you're supposed to do. Oh, then okay. You, then you install them to speed up production. Uh, far right-hand side chest, Joe. Or right hand side. Oh, you just yeah. put them in the chest. To the north, there, right behind that that mountain there, straight straight ahead, up on one of the one of the wall, on the top of the wall, like just on the side of the cliff. There's one of those slugs there. I just couldn't get to it because that's where I was originally going that way, but the scenery just kind of took over. If you want to explore, there's a cave opening. Where? Where? where, where? It's like right over here. And I went in a little bit, but it goes like really. I was going all that time without my torch. Ah, that's probably how I was able to sneak around. I think it's. <clears throat> yeah, it's in here. Huh, I wonder if there's different ore down there. Mycelia? What's this? 
Mushrooms. This is mushroom. That's the stuff I got from that big glowy tree with the chainsaw over there. Biomass burners and vehicles can use it for power. Yeah. There's a shitload of them down here. I'm not seeing any wildlife. That's a huge cave, though. Holy crap. There's a crap load of them. The shrooms. Uh, essentially, there, James. I mean, it's not. It's called Satisfactory. Completely different game, completely different company, but a lot of the same, uh, the same goals and the same kind of basic feel. Ooh, what is that? Summer Sloop. It's a work in progress, whatever it is. This object emits alpha radiation. The material has hydrophobic properties. And you have died. <laughs> handle carefully. Uh, well, it said handle carefully, and I am clearly not handling it carefully. Work in progress, though, so there's no point in us doing it for the moment anyway. Hmm, there's another entrance up here. Oh, did that, did it kill you or something when you were... No, nah, I went all the way through the cave. I'm, I popped out at a different entrance up top. Who died? Is that you, Joe? I, I'm in town crafting. What's I don't see anybody dead. Marks that I could still see on the... Oh, yeah. I don't know, maybe that was my body from where I died before. I went over and looted uh, all, though. I see that slug. There's a slug up on the, the yeah, side of that cliff. Know, yeah. yeah, that's exactly, yeah. That's... We can get to that from up top. We can drop down to it. You could probably just build a ramp for that, to, to be honest. Yeah, I could do that too. Oh, so when you see these nodes... Oh man, damn. Stupid dogs again. It's only one this time. Um, this way? Get out. This way. I have anything to eat. This way? This way? I got that on this summer sleep. I shouldn't even have picked it up. It's got the analyzing this will not give you anything. Work in progress stuff, so it's going to be pointless for the purposes of the beta. What's going on there, Clash? How you doing? Shadow always freaks me out. Look at that. Now, if I can only find... If I can see over the edge to see where this slug is, I can just drop down to it. I'll stand here and wait for you then. Ah, it's, don't worry about me. Hmm. I, I can't see down to it. I'm standing. You'd have to build up to it. I'm standing at it. I need. I see you down there fighting that dog. I'm not seeing yeah. it though when I look yeah, down. Yeah, it's, it's directly to more, more to your left, more further over. How far? A long way or? I'm stand like I'm standing directly underneath where you need to drop to get. And you obviously, I think you would be able to get to it from. Oh, it's got, like, light coming up off of it. You can yeah, see yeah, it yeah, easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, well, that's a piece of cake. Like I said, when, it's, when, when you go to get it, it's glowing like that. So it's really no... Oh, that's, they're easy, easy to spot. Yeah, yeah. So it doesn't look like it does when it's sitting on the ground. It's got fireworks coming off of it. <laughs> it's on fire. You can't miss it, <laughs> you know? Hmm, I didn't take any fall damage from that. Maybe because you just actually dropped off it instead of just, like, maybe jumping off it. I wouldn't put a Draken Lord soul on anything other than melee. Like, the Abyss Lord, you're going to play close range. But remember that mod, you have to be close range for it to have any benefit. 
the abyss lord I th it would probably work on ah. work decently because you're the range on the abyss lord is so short you're going to be up in its up in everything's face anyway it's okay, perfect for the barbarian it's like literally perfect for the barb or the like a melee a squire it would be great for a squire uh Joe, I can't build ramps. Have you got like a bunch of stuff on you to you build need ramps? Concrete. Yeah. God, there's that thing is just so massive. To the east there's limestone being Yeah, uh right, okay. Alright, let me get back to dropping all this biomass back off. Uh wait, don't take it all though, I'm out of concrete. No, I'm not I'm not anybody I'm like a little bit away from the base, but I found something else that's glowing. It's not this. The bug is something else. But it's right on the the top. Like it's right on top of this this thing over here. I don't think I can just manually jump up to it. Though. Maybe, maybe I don't. I... God, I wish you could tab to close these windows. Uh, what's that noise? <laughs> okay, that was it, right? I don't see any more biomass burners anywhere. Joe's got it going on now. Now, what are we going to get out of this? Out of what? Okay, you said it was. It doesn't back. look like it's functioning. I'm still in the process of making stuff. Oh, or maybe that's just a placeholder. It says game phase name. No way. You can climb up uh, vines. Huh. You can climb up vines. I just totally like went all the way up to the top of this little cliff bit. Nice. Oh. oh I can't make it up to this can I? Definitely the peak of it there. All right. Wrecked. What's going on, man? How you been? All right. So yes. there's a crap ton of biofuel in the leak box, Joe. If you need any more, I went around and filled all of the all of the thingies up. Do we need wood for anything else? Because that chainsaw did yield a lot of wood. Okay, I got a mirror. Or there's a box uh, for it. Perfect. Just for the biomass. Beer? You don't need wood for the poles or anything? No. Okay. I got some sort of sphere. Alright. Uh, there was like a few hundred bio biofuel over in the main box too. Yeah, I made a whole bunch. Oh, I gotcha. Well, there's an absolute crap ton there now. The conveyor is too steep. Mm. Oh, nice. It didn't take him that much from Yeah, This green power there. slug, do you mean just throw it in a chest, or do we want to use that anywhere right now? Um, Just in a chest is okay. Yeah, something to pay attention to for next time. All right, so we're good there. I think I'm going to actually have to call it a night. By all means, you guys keep going if you want, but I'm going to have to I'm going to have to get off here and start dealing with uh dinner for the wife and whatnot. Okay. She's got to she's got to work all night, which working on Friday nights sucks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, you know. Oh man.
But anyway, I think that is going to do it. Rekt showed up, so for those of you that know how the routine works, when Rekt shows up to stream, that means it's time for the stream to end. <laughs> oh, no. But uh, thank you all so much for swinging by. There's going to be a whole lot more Satisfactory coming this weekend, and uh, hopefully we can get through all the content available on this co-op playthrough. There had They said that it was going to be really buggy, and I haven't really run into a whole lot of bugginess. Have you guys seen no, anything really. buggy versus your single-player playthroughs? No. Yeah, I mean, everything has seemed pretty decent, and I haven't looked at it single-player yet. I'm assuming it will perform a little better. The game it doesn't run spectacular, I don't think, on uh, in multiplayer, but it's not terrible either, you know? Yeah. But uh, anyway, this is what we got so far. I'll give you all a little tour here before I end. That is yeah, copper you, uh, up the hill there. Uh, so our copper is being mined and coming down all the way over to the base here. This is where it's coming in and we're smelting it. Alright, so now we're we're making the reinforced plates. Nice. And then here, we've got the limestone. The only thing we're using limestone right now for is the concrete, right? There's cement pads or whatever they're yeah. called. Yeah, it's just for cement. Okay. So we've got uh, the limestone being stored up just right here, since we're just kind of manually using that. And then, well, we got the copper bars after they get smelted. They are being turned into copper, or turn, turned into wire at both of these, as you just use... Tons and tons and tons of wire. And then here, the wire is being turned into cable, which is required for, like, all of the power lines and everything. Cool. Yep, here's a biomass burner I missed, but it's got a bunch of fuel in it still. And then we've got the iron production over on this side. Let me start at the beginning here. I'll run you guys through what we got going. Okay. But well, we got three iron miners going, which so far has been overwhelmingly sufficient. We've got tons of iron available. So we got the three iron miners going here and in going into three smelters. So that's all getting smelted up. And then we've got that going directly into... Or no, actually it's going into storage containers first. Then it's going into smelters. Please. Then it's going into storage containers again after it's smelted. And then here is where it's being used. So we're making uh, iron plates here. We're making iron rods on both of these. Because the, the iron rods go a little slow. So we've got two iron rod uh, production facilities. And then they're getting stored, of course. And then the iron rods are coming over to making screws here. And making rotors here which the rotors are requiring the iron rods and then the screws that are being made here. So you see the screws are going into this storage and then it's being split off here. So we've got screws going in to this assembler to make the rotors. This one? And then we've also got screws coming all the way down over here going into this assembler to make reinforced iron plates. And then the rotors are all going into the space elevator, which we need to get to 75 reinforced iron plates. They don't yeah. seem like they're going, or they're just slower. It's just take, yeah, it's com a complicated piece. So we have a new issue. Oh, I only five per the, minute. I installed the power cores into three of the machines. Yeah. So if you overclock it to 150%, it increases the amount of energy that... It it requires, yeah. It almost doubles it. Oh, damn. Is it worth it for the output that you were getting? It's another 50%. So we'll have to figure out power use. Hmm. So it's doubling the power requirement, but only yielding 50% more materials? Right. Yeah. Well, I mean, we'd have to see. I'm sure down the road it's probably 
well worth it to still use them, but look at uh, their billions, for example. Uh-oh. It what costs... Happened? It costs so much I more in their billions. I have something, something. Yeah, back. I heard this shut off. I, th and I didn't do nothing, Matt. <laughs> I didn't touch anything either. I, I haven't touched anything. Ran out of fuel somewhere. It was that. Uh, yeah, maybe. No, uh, I just filled them all, just not this that long ago. Full, this one's full, but key. Did the two at the main had to change? Did did we overclock? The two at I the haven't main touched main anything. Yeah. What'd you touch, Omni? Nothing. Um, nee. <laughs> Nothing. So I guess the answer there then is the first power cell should go into the generators, right? Into the biomass burners. Can you overclock those? Yeah. Same thing. Gives you 50% and probably uses oh, twice as much biofuel. But anyway, that's what we got so far. And then to get to the next tier... We've got to get the space elevator going, and the space elevator is asking for the rotors, which the rotors are all set. And the reinforced plates. Now, why are the reinforced plates not going? Or the power went, is why. There's no more going. But the reinforced plates will eventually get in. But... Damn it. Anyway, that is uh, the space elevator. And the space elevator, as you see... By delivering this stuff, it's going to unlock uh, Tier 3 and 4 for us, which is currently we've got everything researched we can prior to using the space elevator. You know what? It makes me wonder. Would it be quicker just to make 75 reinforced iron plates and throw them in there? Probably, to be honest. <laughs> Probably. It takes quite a bit to make those reinforced. Oh, uh, gotcha. All right, so this is producing 27. But uh, anywho, I'm going to have to get off here all, though. So thank you all so much for swinging by. I do appreciate it. Uh, I'll be live, what's it? It's Friday night. So I'll be live Saturday at noon Pacific time with, uh, I'm not sure yet. I mean, I normally do DD2, but I, and I probably will do DD2 because everybody will crucify me if I don't. But uh, we'll be live again with some more um, satisfactory tomorrow for certain. And then there will be an edited series that's in uh, high definition and I'll come into the channel on a fresh playthrough uh, that I'll be getting recorded over the weekend as well. But anyway, thanks again, y'all. Everybody have a fantastic Friday night or Saturday morning, depending on where you're at. And I will see you all next time. Take it easy. This needs its own power source. Yeah.